good evening, afternoon, morning, night, whatever it is for you. We're jumping back into some Trails to Azure. The goal for tonight is to finish chapter three. Regardless of how long it takes, we have tomorrow off of work, so plenty of time to do what we need to do tonight. So we will be doing that. When boss fights come in guy, read because they usually have DP conditions. That is fair. Alright, let me start up my game. We will stop the a light illuminating, illuminating the depths song here. There we go, sorry. And start up Azure. I'd get the Mars Bell and Ursula jungle just jungle to start. Well, lucky for you, Anixi. I've already done that. I just did that before the stream. All right, let me throw my tea bag away, and then we'll load up the game. Or the file, anyway. Did you get the high-end single tar target fire spell? I got on Tio. I have Crimson Ray. Seems like it hits pretty hard. <clears throat> Alright, so let me load up the game. I was going to do this chest as well. I'm in the Nox Forest. But this chest is a pain in the fucking ass. So I'm gonna wait. I don't want to do that one on stream because you're just gonna tilt the fuck out of me, Annexy, if I do that one. <laughs> Annexy, I got it, man. None of these fights have been, like, difficult. I assume, like, there must be some optional fight that, like, you're supposed to lose or something that you're really worried about. Because everything else has been face real easy. <clears throat> but yeah, so I have the Mars Bell on Tio. I had to put, like, a bunch of random shit on her for it. But we got it. I like to get Crimson Ray, I mean. And I think that's the highest single target spell. Let me make sure. Uh, fire. Oh, that's Quartz. Whoops. Oh. Oh, wait, but this the single target one's Crimson Ray. Okay, good. Jesus, there's a spell that costs 460 EP. What the fuck? What does it hit for? I mean, it depends on the level of the target and all that shit. I hit a very weak um, low level target for 10k with that spell. But then for like those, some other mobs it was like 5k. So like, I feel like Sparkdyne is still like almost better. Hey, let me uh, fix my shit. You know, this is fine. I don't really care. I don't care. Bum, bum, bum. Where's my car? Let me get my T in front of me. Alright, and the sound's gonna cut out for a second because I need to get to the spot on my guide real quick. We are at chapter 3, day 3. There we go. And I believe we have done everything. Bum, 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 bum. So now we will go be going to the Bracer Guild. You're afraid I'll tell you, Sag? It's true. It's alright, I'll do it at the beginning of chapter 4. No big deal. 
<clears throat> if there's one thing I don't want coached through, it's battles. Unless there's a gimmick, like the floor is gonna fall out and kill all my people at once and I have to redo a 30 minute fight, then I want to know that. Bum, 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 bum. Okay. So, plan is br straight to main quest today. I believe that's all we have. Chapter 3. Yeah, everything else is done. Just chapter 3. Michelle contacted us and said he has not been able to contact Lynn or Aeolia since last night. He told us to contact him if we come across either of them. I'm worried. We should drive by the Bracer Guild when we have time. So, that is what we are doing. Go into the Bracer Guild. <clears throat> bum, 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 bum. And even then, Annexy, even if there is a gimmick like that, it's okay that I fail. As long as it's not like the end of the night and I'm trying, I really want to be done. Like, I don't mind failing something <clears throat> and having to redo it if I have plenty of time left in the night. Okay. Let's start off with some dialogue here. I guess I'll have to prepare myself for good old Michel. Oh, this is a surprise. It's good to see you, Michel. We couldn't shake our concerns after you, the, that call you made. <sighs> oh boy, you made it sound like I forced you to come here. But thanks, I'm glad y'all are here. Guessing that means you haven't made contact with Lynn or Aeolia yet. Nope. Arius and the gang are out looking for them right now. I mean, seriously, where the heck are those two? This doesn't sound good. If you can't contact them via their enigmas, does that mean they're out of the state? I was thinking that too, but there's no record of them leaving via the station or airport. Maybe they went to the doll studio like we did. And the same goes for Belgard and Tangram. That does raise some red flags. If Lynn and Aeolia are inside Crossbell State, I may be able to locate them. Um, what about instant one-shot triggers? Uh, yeah, if, I mean, if it's just some bullshit, like, if it's gonna make me fail the fight, yes. If I can just re 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 revive my person, then nah. Just let me be astonished. I see. I see, I see. All right. Let's just continue on. Let, you know, just let me play the game, if anything. If I want to know, I'll ask, I suppose. But I appreciate your tips when you give them a lot of times. <clears throat> really? You can, but how? The Enigma 2 has additional functionality that are left over from testing. One function is to transmit an emergency signal. Ah. What? R really? It is configured to use reserve orbital energy to transmit waves of a specific frequency at fixed intervals. Solely practice part two. Oh my god, dude, that was so tilting! <laughs> uh, I hated that. I mean, looking back on it, it was fun and a good time, but goddamn, in the moment, I fucking hated that. <laughs> However, the waves are weak. As far as I know, the Foundation has not found a practical application for it yet. It was 20% of the stream? No, it wasn't that much. You're crazy. They never removed the function, though. It should be present in production models. So, if we can grab a hold of their faint signal... We'd be able to locate Lin and Aeolia. I think it is worth trying. Chief Roberts is familiar with this function. We should try seeing him at the IBC. I imagine he would be willing to help us. 
<clears throat> Great thinking. We'll head there now. I'm sorry to put you guys through this. Thanks for the assist. If you learn anything, contact me right away. If the situation warrants it, I'll make Arius and the others hurry back. Roger. We're off to the IBC then. To the IBC. Let's let's walk there. I'm not in a hurry tonight. Bum 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 bum. Bum bum bum. Bum 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 bum. <clears throat> Make sure I don't leave anything. Or miss anything. Rather. Before I leave. Here we are. I wonder where we can find Chief Roberts. He is likely upstairs in the Foundation's bra branch office. I will call his enigma. Oh god. Probably the first time she's ever called him. It is me. No, I do not have time for this. <laughs> do not make me hang up this call. <laughs> oh, it's you. Is she giving him a stare through the phone? That poor man. Tia's gonna freeze him cold one of these days. Poor Chief Roberts. I don't know. Something tells me the guy's into it. <laughs> yes, I am calling about the Enig Enigma 2's emergency alert function. Yes. Correct. Okay. Please come downstairs. Is he willing to help us? Yes. He will be down soon. Yona is with him too. That's good. He's the kid that was using the room in the geofront that caught fire, right? And the squirt from the Epstein Foundation that's good at hacking. That's the one. He likes to act like he's hot shit, but he's kind of just a little shit. <laughs> he must be... Si Staying with the Foundation now that his base was destroyed, right? Yes, though he still had a fit over it. God damn it, my tea won't come out. Stupid lid. There we go. Okay, now I get what's going on. You're saying the ordnance are completely off and they can't be contacted. Do we even have to do anything? Shouldn't bracers be strong enough to look after themselves? Can you hear yourself right now, Yona? Now isn't the time to be joking around. <sighs> Excuse Yona. He Yona, he's been like this a lot recently. Which I don't understand. I've done everything to make you comfortable, including letting you use the most powerful terminal in the building. Man, who cares what the specs are? It's never gonna be fun when it's locked down. Give me access codes and set me free already. No can do, jo Yona. <laughs> you know that. If I did that, you would just do whatever you wanted again, wouldn't you? So instead, I've been working on a special palm party training program that you can use until you're finally ready to beat Teal. I, I don't need anything like that to beat her. Turns out he's doing a pretty good job of keeping Yona on a leash. The Chief's overbearing dad tendencies can come in handy, even if they usually get on my nerves. Okay, back to business. It is true that the Enigma 2 has an alert function, but I don't know if it'll be useful. <sighs> Excuse me. Well, why would that be? How could that function not be? It doesn't produce the strongest orbital signal imaginable. If you're not within 10 cells of the orbment, it's impossible to detect, no matter what kind of equipment you're using. Just 10 cells? That doesn't give us a lot to work with. In other words, we'd already know if they were in, within Crossbell City. Sorry. <clears throat> what if you combine the detection instruments with my sensors? If it is a matrix system, it can be synced with the Aeon system. Well, sure, that could. Wait, no, if you use the Aeon system, then the accuracy would be too unpredictable. You'd also have to account for the orbital pressure and the surrounding terrain. I think it'd be near impossible. I suppose it would. I didn't quite get all of that, but I know it's not good. And there really isn't a simple solution. Hold up. 
Why not just do the measurement from the roof of Orcus Tower? Oh, what? Yona? What do you mean? Think about it. The alert waves are weak, so you can't detect them unless your instrument's nearby. You can use Tio's sensor to expand the range, but even then the signal would probably be too inaccurate to be useful. So, what if we use the top of Orcus Tower? There'd be fewer obstructions to account for, so it'd be a lot more accurate, wouldn't it? Uh, anyone following this? Would that work, Tio? Color me surprised. Yona, you really are a genius. That's our little systems engineer whiz. <laughs> I'm the genius Yona Sacred, aren't I? So, does that mean... Looks on our side, isn't it? Yes, it might work. I'll head to Orcus Tower and get permission from management for us to use the roof. You're going to help too, aren't you, Yona? Well, why should I? Is what I'd normally say, but I'm bored, so why not? But you guys owe me one, alright? Sure, that's fine. As long as it's not illegal or unreasonable, we'll be happy to repay the favor. Bum, bum, bum. Chief Roberts and Yona went, on, went to Orcus Tower and were given permission to set up their equipment on the roof. They let the SSs know it would take time before the search would be ready. Lloyd and the others decided they should finish any other outstanding business before heading to Orcus Tower. Um, let me actually get uh, some tissues. I need to blow my nose. I apologize, but it's kind of bothering me. So give me one second. Sorry about the wait there. Sorry about what, if the whole tissue. I didn't bring the whole thing. I've never cried in a Trails game, though. Alright, let's go. JK, by the way. So, to Orcus Tower. Um, Go inside the tower, sure. I have a chapter in finale. Yeah, except, like, chapters take 10 years, Anixi. That's not almost done. What's even gonna happen? What even is the story? F fuck if I know. Some shit's gonna happen. Ouroboros is gonna reveal what they're trying to do, except by reveal, I mean they're gonna accomplish what they're trying to do, and we're gonna have to deal with the consequences. We're gonna beat some... Lady's ass that's in arm full armor for some reason. Wald is gonna like do some bullshit sacrifice of himself because he's like a demon now, and I bet he dies. I can see that happening. And he's gonna save us all to redeem himself, and Wazzy's gonna be sad. He is gonna get kidnapped, I think, or some bullshit. Surprised she still hasn't, to be honest. Alright, that must be him. What's up? Where are you guys? All equipment is ready to go. We just walked through the entrance. Should we head up to the roof? Yeah, the receptionist should give you an elevator access card if you talk to her. Hurry your butts up already. Well, why does he continue to be mysterious? I hope he tells us something. If they actually have just been, like, saying all this mysterious shit and he, like, doesn't actually have a backstory, I'm gonna be really irritated. But I believe. I believe. Right, we'll be there soon. Trails doesn't have details like that for no reason, you know? Sounds like he is ready. 
Yeah, he said the receptionist can give us a card that'll let us get up to the roof. Mind the rain. It'd be best to not make them wait too long. Yes, Ellie, dear. Welcome to Orica's Tower. You'd be the special support section, yes? That's us. We were told you had an access card for us. That I do. Here you are. Receive temporary access card. Insert the card into the elevator's panel and we'll take you directly to the 40th floor. It's valid for one month and fully disposable, so feel free to discard it how you see fit when the time comes. It's good for how long? One month. Uh, oh, okay. It has an expiration date? That's even more high-tech than what they do at the IBC building. Is it still surprising how advanced this place's tech is at this point? Maybe Erebonia invades and everyone dies? That's why there's no trilogy? Listen, I have ex- Alright, so there- I do have exactly one spoiler. Exactly one spoiler from this game, I believe. And that would be that Lloyd is in a future game. So, it's gonna- if one of the, like, surprises is that, like, Lloyd- Lloyd dies, it's gonna be kinda ruined for me, because I already know he's in a future game. <laughs> so please, I hope that's not- I hope that's not, like, one of the shocking moments. Uh... Uh, am I supposed to put it here? Yes, simply insert the access card we were given. Do you love Crossbell? I mean, yeah, there's a lot of great characters in this city. But Annexy, don't try to don't try to lead me towards anything, you know. <clears throat> Just let me go. I mean, more than anything, I love the SSS. But Crossbell is pretty pretty good. Lloyd, insert the card into the panel. 40th floor. <laughs> it said, get off. Maybe later. Arkan Seal's pretty good, yeah. Yeah, they're good characters. Ily Ilya's like, okay. But I really like Rishia, and I think Soli's a really good character as well. Most of the police department, uh, police department's fine. Um, the Bracer Guild, I, I enjoy all of them. The Saber Vipers and Testaments are, like, fine. Saber Vipers are more funny. But, you know, I don't want them to be killed or anything. <clears throat> I think whatever, what other, like, significant people? Grizzly Grim, he's cool. Um, Maribel, Mayor Croy are good characters. I mean, there's a lot of good kill. Obviously, Grace. I love Grace. Colin. Colin can fuck off. If something's gonna happen, hopefully it happens to him. His father and mother are fine, though. Oh, yeah, Rias. Well, technically, she's outside of the city. <laughs> she's at the church, but Rias is my girl. That's who our... Alright, that's who... You know how yesterday I said, look, there's two slots... There's two slots next to the support members, or in the support member box. One of those members, we're definitely getting Rishia. It's impossible for us to not get her. It's like the easiest call in the world, right? Second member, Rius. Has to be. So we get Rishia and Rius in our team. And I'd be okay with that. Sister Marble, yep, she's, she's nice. I don't want anything to happen to her. Bitch! Yo, what's up, Panda? How's the work going tonight, bro? Now, Darren, I think some, some stuff's about to happen. So, I wouldn't stay around for too long, because once I continue the story, I'm, I believe there's going to be some pretty massive spoilers coming up. Annex, they can probably confirm. I want another job location, so I'm doing nothing. Oh, that's hype. Hell yeah, brother. Alright. Okay, I'll peace out soon. Yeah, yep. Yeah. Did you pick up those Trails games yet, or are you just gonna kinda wait and see? 
Because no they're all on sale on Steam. I I'm gonna pick up Trails of Cold Steel 4. It's the only one I don't have yet, so I might as well get it on Steam. You're waiting, didn't even get on your computer last night? Damn. Damn, son. Alright, let me continue with the story. I'll do it tomorrow. I feel you. Same. Maybe you'll buy it? Nah, you don't need to do that, Anixie. You don't need to do that. I'm in unsubbing moods. It's okay. I don't really care if people sub or not. It's no big deal. No big deal. You're someone here to talk to. <clears throat> Alright, let's 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 move forward. And hey, I just noticed something weird about the panel. There aren't buttons for floors 21 through 30. I would guess that they're all maintenance floors. What are maintenance floors? Hey, it's 40 floors, man. It's a long ride. I was told these floors are mostly empty. It is necessary to counterbalance the weight of the tower. Additionally, there's equipment housed there to absorb the shock of potential earthquakes. I wonder if that's how actual buildings are done. I don't know much about architecture and stuff. Wow, that's amazing. This really is the most modern building on the continent, isn't it? I guess, but why'd they have to go and make the thing so dang tall? If it were 30 stories, it'd still be using the same number of floors. I don't know, but I'd suspect there were several changes and compromises made after the design was finished. Uncle was the one who took over the design, and knowing him, he likes to go, to go over the top whenever he can. Ultimately, the Croy family were the ones to make up the construction budget shortfall. Oh, wasn't that magnanimous of him. <laughs> True, but there's no denying that the tower being a landmark is going to be a boon for Crossbow as a whole. Maybe you're wrong about this? Second. But after tower, go to Ilya's apartment first floor. Um... What for? Or... Okay. Unless it's a spoiler. Okay. I'll take a look. Sure. <clears throat> Alright, true, but there's no denying towers. The landmark's gonna be a boon for Crossbow as a whole. True. Okay. And hey, looks like this is our stop. Yeah, they tend to do that, don't they, Anixie? body is being nasty. I got like my nose running. It's going into my throat. Sucks tonight. Oh. So we're looking for a Lin and Aeolia, right? Like I wonder why they're missing. Join the being sick club? I don't really feel sick. I just have like I don't know. Ah, hot tea will fix it. I've been, I'm drinking some tea. Alright. The rain is finally letting up. Yeah, and the view is just as awesome as the last time we were up here. Definitely. I'm not saying something with it not even being clear day out. Wait, where are Yona and Chief Roberts? Yo, Darren, I'm I'm excited to watch you play Trails uh, in the Sky the Third. Can't wait for you to start. That's my favorite game. They should be nearby, likely on one of the platforms. Need to beat Pokemon? Yeah, I feel ya. Let's look for them. If you're not trying to like catch every single Pokemon, beating it's pretty quick, honestly. Right, so we need to go to one of these platforms. Not here. Not here. No, nope, over here. With your newfound free time, you should stream Nightmare Trails Saga. Yeah. You could. 
could do that, man. And Nightmare East. Oh. Hey, there you guys are. Get it, Yona. Get it, kid. So, this is the equipment for detecting the alert signal? Right, but the way it is right now, it can only detect signals within 10 stage radius. When does Nightmare Streams? Well, that's because most people watch trail streamers for their reactions to the content, or like, like to what's going on. And I would say like, just watching them do the nightmare fights, I don't know. I mean, it'll appear, it'll will appeal to some people for sure, but I think the most common thing people watch trails for is reactions. And forgetting the story. All right, All right. But the way it is right now, it can only detect signals within a tilted cell radius. That's where Tio comes in. It will not be an issue. Will the weather have an effect on the detection? No, we should be good. I don't think a drizzle like this will make too much of a difference. Zach O oh, face in tears every day. <laughs> there you go. Exactly, NXT. See? Ah. Oh, now I get it. Of course, a lady like you wouldn't want to be exposed to the elements for too long, Tio. Where are my manners? I'll hold an umbrella over you while you fire up your sense- Not necessary. That would be a distraction, if anything. Aw, man. <laughs> it's like the dotting father that is, just gets rejected by the daughter. It's like the common anime trope. <laughs> I love it. Doting. Alright, I'm good to go on my end. Start up the Aeon system when you're ready. I am ready. Have you entered Lin and Aeolia's Enigma 2 serial numbers? Sure did. The guild supplied them to us. I put them in before you got here, so all that's left is for you to do your thing. Alright then. Good luck, Tio. If anyone can locate Lin and Aeolia, it's you. Right. Here I go. Activating Aeon System. Now syncing Aeon System with search equipment through Matrix Protocols. Oh, hell yeah, this song. Link confirmed. This is shaping up to be a piece of cake. Oh, this song is pog. Orbital energy to the search equipment is stable and high. Go ahead, Tio. Roger, here goes. Releasing sensor functions. Aeon system. Limit break. <laughs> Hell yeah. Yo! Did, did you see that? Are my eyes playing tricks on me or did a wave just come off of Tio? Good song. Big fan. Phew. Good job, we got it. We got their location? Uh, really? You were able to locate them? Yup, well, the location of their Enigma 2s anyway. True. I was able to trace both of their alert signals. They are to the far south. Uh, far south. We talking like Ursula Road, Stargazer Tower South, or farther south? <laughs> La Barrel? They got the fuck out of here and went to La Barrel. <laughs> no problem. Having the data you got cross referenced with the map. Boom. Done. Oh. We have not been over there. That's like across the fucking lake, right? What? Area to the south of Lake Elm? The hell? Is there anything out there? As far as I know, all that's there are, wet are the wetlands. It's completely uninhabited. What would those bracers be doing there? Heck if I know, but 
This ain't good, is it? Hmm. Right, it's very concerning. Lloyd. <sighs> Let's start by reporting this to Michelle. As a precaution, we should ask headquarters to prepare a boat for us, too. You're right. That's the best. That's for the best. Time is of the essence, so we need to move. Thanks for all the help, Chief Roberts. You too, Yona. Uh, don't mention it. We'll clean up here, so go on ahead. Yeah, get a move on. Be careful out there, got it? <sighs> oh, God. Congestion. Yes, and the Orbal boat has been prepared for you at the Harbor District's dock. You can board it as soon as you're ready. Got it. Thanks, Fran. Sorry for the sudden request. Oh, don't mention it. It's times like these that I'm here to support you. The wetlands to the south can be dangerous. Be extra careful out there, you hear me? We will. I'm right, blowing my nose again real quick. Okay, sorry about that. Whew. Whew. Sounds like we have a boat. Yeah, friend was able to have them prepare us one. That. Whew. Y'all are gonna make me rely on you to the bitter end, aren't you? You sure you're all fine with this? I'm pretty sure Arius and the boys will be back in like an hour tops. Time's of the essence. Tell them to catch up because someone's gotta go now. He's right. There's no telling how dire the situation may already be. And tell them to head straight for us when they get back to the city. Okay. Both Lynn and Aeolia are highly capable bracers, on the verge of being A-rank. If they found themselves in a situation where they can't contact us, I can only imagine that they, what they came across. There's no telling how dangerous it is down there. You'd better be careful. We will be. We should depart for the dock as soon as we are prepared. Alright, we got a couple things. Annexy said check Ilya's apartment, so we can do that. Which is residential, right? Not residential. Wait. Maybe it is residential. That or East Street? I can't fucking remember. East Street. Or West Street. God, I'm all confused! It's this place. Yeah, yeah, I saw that. We gotta go talk to Yona. I'll get him. Don't worry. Do, do, do. Alright, door's locked here, so... Ilya's apartment, not accessible. Ba -ba -bum. Ba -ba. So let's go back to Orcus Tower. So he's on the roof again? Well, actually, it could just be inside. It just says he's in Orcus Tower. Notice the nightmare mode disclaimer. Shit's about to get real. Uh, oh yeah, it does say nightmare mode preparation. Yeah, the redo day three. Oof. Oh, there's there's Yona. Oh yeah, you have a pawn party account, right? I'm feeling generous, so I'll give you my deets. I've been playing this game from day one, so if you think you've got what it takes, I invite you to be proven wrong. That sucks she had to redo it, though. <laughs> Alright, let's uh, save. We're gonna do a new file. Because you never know. You didn't have the grills. The girls' trinkets? Or... You mean the, the ones that make them OP casters? Got through Zero and Azure Nightmare to this point using strength trinkets on everyone. Impressive. Alright, so looks like going to the police station. Alright, we're right by it. What do you know? 
I mean, I may still get shit on, but that's okay. It's also normal mode, so I'm not real concerned unless it's like some optional fight bullshit. Then I might have to actually try. I'll let you fail, but to avoid tilting. Fair enough, Anixie, fair enough. I, I appreciate that. Oh, hey guys. Like I said earlier, there's an orbital boat in the Harbor District with your name on it whenever you're ready. Thanks, Fran. We'll head there as soon as we're ready. I know you guys have to head to the wetlands in order to find those bracers. I'm still a little worried for you all. I mean, I heard those two are almost A rank, yet somehow they still... Fran. I know what you're getting at. I'm sorry to make you worry. <sighs> More than anything, I wish I could go with you to back you all up. Oh, I know. Would you like to take Bonbon bon with you as a good luck charm? Bonbon? Bon? Wait, isn't that... Yes, it's our teddy bear. He's great at giving hugs and calming you down. <clears throat> Can you say you hug yours the same way when no one's watching you, Noe? Whoa, what? I, ne I never said that, Fran. It pains me to send Bonbon bon somewhere so dangerous, but if it's for your sake, I'll let him do his duty proudly. <laughs> it's okay, Fran. You don't have to do that. I think we'll manage. <laughs> Thanks for worrying about us, though. Things have been a little tense today. I think that was just what we needed to hear. How- yeah, how very, Fran. Well, you mean how is Bonbon bon gonna protect us? Who knows, but... Fran is just being Fran. Fran isn't only our operator, she's her own little pick-me-up. Not to mention a veritable gold your mind of juicy details about Noel's private life. Darn it, Fran! I'll get you for this! <laughs> Always happy to help, guys. Watch each other's backs out there, okay? We will. Excuse me, sorry. You s uh, we already went to her apartment. There's nothing there, Anixie. Did you not just see me before going to Orca's Tower? The bottom floor? Oh, you I thought you meant her room. I was just there, though. Look, look. Old lady, that's it. I don't know if these are... Oh! Wait. This is, is this the guy from, wait, is this the liberal guy? The, or the uh, Roland guy, rather? I see his discharge from St. Ursula a few months ago. That's right, I haven't heard from him much since then, though. God damn it, you thing. Well, just only having this information after you took the- I need to see the woman's name. Took, took the time to make the trip out here. Yeah, these are the ones we did the, the ring quest for, right? In Roland? And we, we attended their wedding? I think. This has been months. They making babies. Man, they got a child. What do you know? Look at them. Look, you know, you know, <laughs> you know why the Crossbill arc is better than the Liberal arc? Because all of the good Liberal NPCs are in Crossbill. <laughs> uh. That's quite all right. What you told us has been helpful. Right, dear? Yes, Ellie. I'd say today was a win for all three of us. Go, go, ga, ga. <laughs> Aren't you three a happy family? We should go check the hospital next. Who are they looking for? I feel like we're getting closer to finding him one step at a time. 
Who are they? I'm in Shira's grown up still. Where has that idiot run off to? Who are they talking about? Discharge from St. Ursula. Fuck, that could be anybody. Um, okay. What else do- so, now we go to... I don't want to play- uh, I guess real quick we'll try to beat Yona and Pom Pom Master, whatever it is, but oh my. He's probably gonna kick my ass. I don't remember the controls either is the problem. Um, well, yeah, this is, this is not a great start. Why didn't I just put this here? Oh, great. Get fucked, Yona. I should have got rid of that yellow fuck. Oh shit. Here we go. Oh my god. Oh wow. Oh, oh god. I'm a god. I'm a god. Not a god. Oh, baby. Um, blue. Oh, wait, yellow. This is it. Damn, he's kind of good, actually, though. Um... Ah, shit. Oh, fuck. No! Fuck. It's over. It's over. We fucked up. Wait. Yeah, we're gonna have to rebattle him. I can already feel it. Unless... Oh, he just cleared that. Damn it. to get that Shit. So this is a tough one. It's a toughie. Oh, is that death? Fuck, Yona, you little asshole. Low CP does nothing. 
do I need to try to stack them up instead of doing just one at a time every time? I wonder. We'll see. Maybe stacking is the key. I don't know where this one. Or this one. Yeah, just try to save it up. Got it. We'll do that then. For the full burst, do. What if we do five at once? Will that beat him? No! I was hoping it would. Fuck. Soiled it. That was our chance too, man. Keep going! Kill him! It didn't kill him. Well, you fucked up now. I went for the kill too early. And now we're dead. God damn it! Yellow. Green and red. Oh, I should put the red above it. Damn it. Save them all. We must save them. Oh, I needed that green. Fuck. This one isn't going as hot. Maybe? Have six, you bitch! Didn't win. Hey! We did it! We did it. Hell yeah. Get wrecked, idiot. Okay, Yona defeated. Took a little longer than I expected. I like that. I like those kind of games, they're really fun. Okay, now we can progress. Scroll down. To the harbor. Get it, Nikolai. You're slow though, bro. Bum, 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 bum. So, uh, who's this? Citizen. Hey, you're the SSS, right? That's us. We've been waiting for. Wait, you've been waiting for us out here in the rain? Thank you for preparing this for us, given the conditions. I thought the rain stopped. Don't mention it. All part of the job. So, do you all have someone who can operate this thing? If you don't, I could always come with you. I hadn't thought about that. Watch, Noelle probably can drive a boat. How hard could it be? It's probably not that different from driving a car. I could always call the Chief's Enigma. No, it's okay. I actually have a little bit of experience driving boats. Thank you, our chauffeur. You do? <laughs> Is there anything you can't drive, Noelle? We should have figured, given it as a steering wheel. <laughs> Knock it off. It's just another thing Commander Bales insisted I learn. What are we gonna do? What are we going to do? Is it time for us to board? Well, let me think. 
There's no telling what's waiting for us down there. We should make sure we've taken care of everything before leaving. Once you board the boats and head to the wetlands, you'll be unable to leave until the current story section has concluded. You don't need Crimson Rain unless boss is coming? Well, I mean, there's no reason to take it away. Oh, if you want AoE ads, all right, we'll be fine. Any short-term quest events will expire. Uh, let's head to the wetlands. Roger that. All right, you six, be careful out there. Wait, it's too late for that, sir. Are all the quests turned in? Probably not. Bum, bum. Oh, Heyway. Heyway. And Rishia. What we got here? <clears throat> well, that's interesting. I can't help but be reminded of the Schwartz auction. Perhaps they truly are tied by a string of fate. Be that as it may, Master Cal. What do you think is waiting for them at the south banks of Lake Elm? I'm not sure, but I'll trust in our friend's intuition. It could be that that demonized delinquent again. The snakes, or perhaps even the grail itself. The grail? Whatever the case, there's nothing wrong with shining the light on a blind spot when you can. Well, I understand. P pardon me! Uh-oh. What is it, Fun? Why are you so distraught? P -p please forgive me. We received an urgent report from one of the surveillance teams moments ago. An urgent report? Huh? Please, Fun, explain calmly and slowly. Oh, I guess we're not hearing the report. Okay. Fair enough. Fair enough. What is this? Or is that Michelin? The weather has cleared as the forecast predicted. Maybe Idios is trying to do us a solid. I'd rather she have her back. There's no telling what's waiting for us over there. What if- alright. What if this is all a ruse? To get the SSS away from Crossbell. You know? What's that? Ah. I'll take this over investigating in the rain any day. Yeah, but don't forget there's a chance we could encounter another cryptid. That's true, but we're going into a total unknown. Anything that could happen in this situ anything could happen in this situation. Keep in mind we don't know whether or not we can count on backup from Arius this time either. We're the lead search party. We need to work as quickly as possible to secure Lin and Aeolia's safety. And depending on the situation we find, we may have to call the CGF for backup too. Right. This is definitely a sticky situation. Let's keep up the ho up hope the gals are alright. Hold on. Sudden increase in humidity confirmed. Everyone stay on guard. What? What the fuck? Oh boy. Is it is Luciola gonna attack us or some shit? A dense fog. Where did it come from? Things looked so clear a moment ago. What what do we do, Lloyd? Ugh. Reduce speed and exercise caution upon approach. Tio, can you sense the shore? Yes, I believe so. What was I just saying? Be ready anything be ready for anything the second we get there. Ah, spoopy music. By the way, Anixi, all of our quests are turned in, because we turned in the Ark and Seal one last night, and that was the last one. To verify the... <coughs> DP. <clears throat> Damn it. The boat back there must be the one Lin and Aeolia arrived in. 
Damn, they had a little bitty boat, didn't they? This is bad. It's out of control down here. What's out of control? Oh, oh shit! Blue flowers everywhere. And treasure. Azure Wetlands. Back to our namesake, or game's namesake, right? I'm feeling we just stepped into a bad dream. This feels more like something ripped straight out of a fairy tale. Th this is unbelievable. It looks as if the very composition of space itself has been altered from reality. How long has Plimer Pleroma grass been growing out of control here? This is it. This is where Joachim was harvesting it to use the key ingredients in Gnosis. Use as the key ingredients. Has really no one been out here? Like, that sounds crazy to me. Voice. Alright, no voice acting. Seeing it like this, I would say that's another correct deduction. Ah, Risha. Okay, okay. Hell yeah. Uh-huh. You again? Yin, what are you doing here? I do believe that's my line. I've been following the shadows of those snakes and the demonization of that gang's leader. Demonization? As well as the blooming of these blue flowers and the sudden appearance of cryptids. That led me here and ultimately to all of you. Oh, really? So, you basically thought this place was suspicious and decided to check it out? When is she gonna reveal herself to us? That's what I wanna know. Precisely. It's probably gonna be like an accident when it does happen. Though, it would seem the circumstances that led you here are slightly different than mine. Isn't that right? Y you could say that. I'll explain everything I can. Withholding information won't do either of us any good. Lin, or <laughs> Lin, Lloyd told Yin about how Lin and Aeolia have gone missing and about their search for them. I see. So that boat there belongs to those bracers, then. How intriguing. This can only mean I'm getting close to the heart of the mystery. What mystery? He's referring to the Pleroma grass. The cryptids, too, for that matter. You have been trying to get to the bottom of what's caused them to appear as well, haven't you? Bright, aren't you? This falls under my contract with Heiwei. Now, I'll leave the bracers to you and make my way ahead. Not so fast. How about you accompany, uh, accompany us instead, Yin? L lloyd You can't be serious. <sighs> a feeling that you're going to do something like this again. As did I. Come on, man. You're a little too flexible when it comes to stuff like this. As interesting as your proposition is, Bannings, aren't you forgetting something? Our positions are completely different now, as are our interest in this case. Unlike that time at St. Ursula, cooperating with you now would get me... <laughs> nowhere? Is that what you're gonna say? Lin and Aeolia have A-rank bracer talent. I saw it myself. When they joined forces, I have no doubt that those two could rival Arios himself. If the danger facing us was able to overwhelm them, do you actually believe that you'll be fine by yourself? Hmm. Desperate times call for desperate measures. Hey, you might even be able to get some info from Lin and Aeolia after we find him. That's right, we should cooperate for the sake of efficiency. <laughs> You've been influenced by your leader in more ways than one, haven't you, SSS? Do you think so? Well, I'd be lying if I said no. Not that we ever signed up for it. Why are you looking at me like it's my fault? <laughs> it's one of your many charms, after all. Very well, then. If you so desire, we shall work together once more. Know this, however. If the Divine Blade of Wind catches up with us, I will not hesitate to leave. Why specifically him? Will that be an issue? 
Not at all. Why does she not want to be near him? I mean, I'm just confused there. One problem, though. Moving around with a party of seven is gonna get tricky. Yin kills people? Uh, oh, I guess she really is an assassin. Right? You're right, you're right. And Arya's probably doesn't like that. <laughs> Well, I wouldn't be surprised if we ended up running into each other when monsters decide to attack. Someone could stay behind if that's the case. We do need someone to watch the boat, right? Not a bad idea. Whoever remains behind could accompany the Divine Blade of Wind whenever he arrives too. It's a plan then. Let's decide on our formation. Wait, is our- our shit's actually limited to seven. Or, not seven. Six. Well, I know who's getting left behind. That's a no-brainer. <laughs> I still haven't repaid them for that craft they taught me. There's no time for hesitation. We're gonna bring Lynn and Aeolia home. Tio, Fuck off! <laughs> Which member will you leave- it, You don't even get the pick, really! It's one of the fucking newbies! Which member will you leave on standby? Sorry, Noel. I'm sorry. Easy choice, honestly. <laughs> All right, let's go do some searching around. Look, it's their boat. Are we gonna say anything about it? Small boat is banked here. This must be the boat those two used. We should head further in and look for them. Alright. Alright, not very complex, that's good. Be easy to, uh, search through. Seize the truth. It's a burst location. Albatron. I got it, Anxie. I got it. Land the bird native to Crossbell, it intimidates foes with a high pitched shriek. Well, it's dead. Decent XP. Surprise lunchbox. That wasn't very Kashmira of you. <laughs> Stupid. Alright, they both lead the same spot. Ooh. Whoa there, buddy. Aww. Kuruin. Species of ancient sacred beast has numerous energy absorption and attack levels. Level 71. You're not in range, book. We can just smack them all. Easy. Let's go grab this chest that I see. Big old plant. Plant, plant bitch. The fuck is that little white thing? Oh wait, Risha's in our party. I kind of want to use- <laughs> I forgot we had her with us. Mad Blin- I'm gonna probably actually use her. I'll just swap out one of the girls for a second. Tell the boss. Large demonic flower that... Guess it's music to source space around it. What is this thing? Porcelain cocoon. Shaped by the powers of another world, physical attacks are reflected off of it. It's good to know, so we have to kill that with arts. What was it weak to? I mean, everything. Oh, Tio's attacks don't reflect? Oh. 
I mean, I'd rather not have her doing that for a year. Girls fucking hit hard with their arts, though. Oops. Ebony boots. You open the chest. Inside it is a tiny palm. It would wave, but it has no arms. Now, what are these ebony boots? Anyone can use them? Two movements. Uh, they need their evasion. These don't have evasion, right? Yeah. No speed. They don't have speed. And it's the same armor. If it was like a big increase in defense, I would use them, but the lack of armor is not great. Um, I wanna get that chest. <laughs> God damn it. Gotta pay attention for those stupid death blows. Stuff always catches me off guard. UP Church 2. And another Trails in the Chest. Not a fan of those. I mean, I'll probably read them all in one time, but. Fuck. Yeah. Oh, you asshole! What the hell? Sep it up. Don't need it. Use the fire bolt too. So, got the launch rock boots, and there's one more towards the bottom. Got it. Might be able to get a level here. In this place. Oh, shit. Is this gonna get us fucked up? Oh, no, it killed them all. Hell yeah. 71! I'm glad we're getting- this is like a new map, right? So, this place and the, uh, Nox Forest, like, training grounds. Just brand new areas for me. Beat the Busta. Mm. Nah, we want Zero Field. Or whatever it's called. Keep it at that. Man, I really want to use Risha. 890 strength. Oh, she's weak as fuck, though. Look at her master chords. Let's see. Phantom. Grant strength, arts, speed boost in battle. How do I, like... I can't actually see... Bonus is a team attack. Mm -hmm. Speaking of... Alright, she only has one thing. Man, I really want to use her. But she's definitely weaker than my... I mean, I can use her just for fun for a, a little bit. Just for, like, a couple battles. <laughs> God damn it, Ellie. Hit your shots! Bunch of Sepith. If monsters like to eat Sepith, and I was full of Sepith, does that make me a... Oh no. Why are we chasing butterflies? Annexy. Alright, let me go to my next screen. Looks like we got three screens. Fantastic. Oh, you mean all the little glowy things? 
Oh, what's this? Ah! Oh, shit. What is she trapped in? Isn't that Aeolia? It, yeah, but... Some type of ivy. It's not pl pleroma grass, at least. They look nothing alike. Well, we have to hurry and help her. <laughs> Easy there. Finally coming around, huh? Phew, thank goodness. Where am I? Finally has the love of his life in his arms? That's not Muriel. Am I in heaven? My angel Tia is here, so I must be. <laughs> she is fine. <laughs> if your sense of humor is still intact, then I take it everything else is, too. He's always shot down by her every time, yeah. Because she only cares for Tio. <laughs> yeah, more or less. Though I still feel like I got hit by a normal truck. Anyway, did Michelle ask you to come? Yes, actually. When the others briefly explain the details surrounding their search and rescue mission. And you wound up here too. Lynn and I are following a lead about the cryptids and those blue flowers when we arrived in the wetlands. In the middle of our investigation, we found the fight of our lives. A fight of your... against who? It must have been a cryptid, right? No, a human, I think. Huh. Ugh. Well, you don't like white hair? I like white hair on uh, anime characters. Someone from Ouroboros, if I were to guess. Oh, shit. Huh? Could it be the one we heard about at the doll studio? Yep. It says she... She was accompanied by three girls, each skilled at, and each dressed like knights from the Middle Ages. Interesting. That's definitely her. The uh, seventh Angus. It took all of our strength just to defend ourselves. The female knights. It's them. In the heat of the fight, I got separated from Lynn. Then I was restrained by a boy who called himself the Fool or something. Oh shit. Oh shit. Coppinell is here too. Or was. That was when I got stuck in that ivy and couldn't move. I wonder why they don't just kill people though. Maybe it's just not their M.O. He tied you up and just up and left? A freaking maniac, man. Unless he's trying to bait us here by doing that. That would be a reason to leave them alive, I guess. Be grateful that is all you did, Randy. Thanks. That fills in the gaps. We're gonna venture further in and see if we can locate Lynn, too. Stay here. We have someone on standby who can come and look after you. Thank you for that. Please take care of Lynn. Whenever she encounters strong opponents, she tends to bite off more than she can chew. We'll find her. There isn't any time to waste. We need to get going. Members currently on standby was informed of the situation has to move ahead. Oh, okay. Okay. Fun fact, the retry option in Soli's quest, completely unique to Geofront Azure. Don't know what I'm talking about? You either nailed it, or really messed up today. Wow. I mean, you just have to keep resetting the game. Oh, and they mean, they mean if I don't know what they're talking about. I fucked up. <laughs> Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh, they mean you didn't do the quest. <laughs> That's true. Uh, imagine. Imagine. That's hilarious. Wrecked it. Oh, that fucked that up, though. God damn it.
Bum, bum, bum. Alright, where am I on this map? Okay. So we just got that tier old bomb or whatever, right? Stupid bird. We will definitely be bringing Tio back in for the inevitable boss fight at the end of this. Hey, a quartz fragment. Inside the treasure chest was absolutely nothing. Nothing after nothing came bursting out. You come from. Will we get another level before the bosses? Possible. Damn it, Randy. You have failed me. Yokai. Oh shit, I see what I'm about to get. Is this a monster chest? How did I know? How did I know? Actually, we might... She doesn't really have AoE on her. Eh, if I, let's try with the reshift. It's fine. I feel scared. Oh boy. Very cool. I should use the sucking thingy. Why didn't I use the suck? Where is my craft? There it is. Lions, foes. Oh my god, it's fucking the entire zone. Hell yeah. Fuck him up, Risha. <laughs> Ba -da -ba -da. Oh, oh shit! Yeah, GG to her. She got fucked up for doing that. <laughs> At least counters don't reflect learning experience. <laughs> Yeah, she got so fucked up. Oh, man. Alright, too bad. We want Ellie to just take out these things, please. Oh, yeah. Yes, move to another one. Oh, yes. Move together, idiots. Fools. Here, we'll, we'll pick her up. <laughs> There we go. Yeah, Rishi got fucked up. <laughs> By herself. Hmm. She didn't get any XP for- th Oh wait, she's level 73, that's why. She didn't get XP. Oh baby, evade three. I used to be a normal chest and then some blue haired lab coat wearing jerk stored red pills inside of me. <laughs> All right, Lloyd, it is time. Oh, he's still in 95%, fuck. He couldn't do it, he just couldn't make it. What's wrong? Wait, that's extra? No, 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 that's not how that works. <laughs> Is it? Oh no! This whole time! Where do you see...
Just take off Gem? He's a hundred and five. Are you sure? Are you sure, sir? Wait, so we still need the gem. <clears throat> that just puts him at... Because he wasn't at 100 before. Alright, that's fine. That's good that he's right. He's at that then. We good, we good. So that means he's over 100%. Lloyd is now officially a god. But what... Is the, uh, Anixi, is the quartz that lets you dodge spells in this game? Are, the one from Zero? <coughs> Don't know. Because then he'd truly be invincible. <laughs> or art, sorry. It's not needed. But then he's lit- He'd be literally invincible if he could. Physical is what hurts. I mean, I get that, but being invincible would be cool. They're wimpy versus me? I see. Enigma. It's the status effect? That, that is the fucking truth, you're right. Cannon's not level 3. Hell yeah, more arts. I wish I could have a Grail Locket on Lloyd, but I would lose too much dodge, I think. Well, for sure. Alright, what's this? Rush Emblem. Probably makes the team rush things happen more often. One more chest here. Good non-boss trinket. Yeah, I still feel like switching shit. <laughs> These fights are pretty inconsequential right now. <laughs> More chance for team attack. Yeah, I get you. I get you. I see the value for sure. Enigma. That's true. You do get bonus XP, which is nice. I refuse, though. What's the percent that it gives? That's what I'm curious. Rush emblem. Gain CP faster, team rush chance up. But it just says chance up. I wish it would say, like, percent chance up. Ah, oh, shit. We're not getting it then. No. We fucked up. We will now be attacked. Oh, good shit, Randy. There's our final chest. Shoot the stupid bird. Fuck. 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 She turned around. You dumbass! At least the game acknowledges that all trinkets are shit. It gives you other useful items. True. I hate guard. I hate it. Rising Sun 2, sure. Yeah, all the weapons and armor stuff are really good. I like that about this game. <clears throat> Celestial Bomb EX. The chest you have opened is not in service. Please leave a message after the clack. Okay. Level up. Tio's the only one that hasn't yet. Oh wait, no. Ellie too. 
Uh, looks like we have one more area. You have to overcome Lloyd's 20% armor agility because, well, it'll get outclassed. What does that mean? Oh, you mean the armor piece will get outclassed. I get you what you're saying. Hmm. <laughs> Found her. There's Lynn. At least she's okay. Is Zamiri and Tomfa's our evasion. Are they like a weaker weapon? Oh wait, you mean the Zamirian or Tomfa's? Oh shit. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Lynn, are you alright? Her life does not appear to be in any danger. She most likely collapsed from exhaustion. Move aside, I'll attempt to resusc resuscitate her. Y you can do that? I thought you could only kill. Oh. Rise! Ugh. I think I think Lynn would be a cool party member to have. A f a, like a badass chick that just punches the hell out of shit. I'd be into that, you know? <laughs> Did I pass out? I must have. Lynn, do you remember what happened to you? Yes, though I'm ashamed to admit it. Wait, where's Aeolia? Is she safe? Don't worry, we already found her. Lloyd and others explained the events that happened up until now to Lynn. Sorry for all the trouble, guys. And thanks. You're Lloyd at 17 move? That's so unnecessary. <laughs> still. I guess I still have a long way to go as a martial artist, huh? Never experienced anything like that. Felt like an ant trying to chop down an oak tree. You mean against those knights? No, not all of them. The three subordinates are strong too, but the other one... There's no comparison. She's in a completely different class than the others. I don't think even Arios could match her. Oh shit. Oh shit. So why the fuck is this lady so strong? I mean, the only people I know strong are, like, Divine Blades, and... I mean, I guess, uh, Luve was really strong. He wasn't a Divine Blade. Huh. What? You're shitting me. How's that possible? Could it have been the anguish that Yorg told us about? The terrifying warrior referred to as the Steel Maiden. Lloyd has a strong heart, true. The power of friendship overcomes all, so I know we're gonna win in the end. That sounds like her, all right. There was also a boy who called himself the Fool, and an older man wearing a lab coat. Oh shit, they're literally all here. But for what? What is here? Even with that Zhang Shou with you, I don't see you standing a chance. Do you get what I'm telling you? I do, but... I mean, we really should wait for Arios. Hmm. Well, then we lose Yin, though. I am Yin. There is no opponent li alive I cannot conquer. If you are daunted by what, by what lies ahead, I would prefer to end our cooperation here and now. H hold on a second. Are you getting a little ahead of yourself? You can't possibly go it alone now. She can go it? Yeah, she did say go it. We should call Noelle and have her come here to look after Lynn, too. Randy's strong? Randy is strong, yeah. I mean, he's the son of, like, one of the strongest, uh... Uh... Well, I think one of the strongest, uh, Jaegers, right? Is his uncle stronger than his dad was before he died? I'm curious. Because I know... I know his uncle and cousin are more of just, like, the fighters. Whereas his dad was like the leader, right? So I'm wondering if they were, if they were strong or are stronger. Are you sure you don't need reinforcements? This doesn't sound like an average fight waiting for all of you. 
Sigmund's a monster? Yeah, I, I bet he is. <laughs> I want to see him in action against something or someone. I bet he's fucking crazy. I know. At the very least, I want to scope ahead and figure out what they're doing here. What he said. We'll try our best to avoid the Steel Maiden person. Well, we have to. Leader of Zephyr and Red Constellation are dead. I see. I see. Fine. That'd be for the best. You'll recognize her right away. The bulky armor and flowing cape are hard to miss. <laughs> this lady's gonna seem so out of place. <laughs> with just big ass armor and a cape. Why? Why does she have this? The War God and Jaeger King. Yeah. True. True. Arius and the others shouldn't be far behind, so too, so don't do anything rash, okay? Understood. Roger. We need to move. The fool and those knights are bad news on their own. But the woman with the helmet? She's in a different league than them. To be honest, even with that Zhang Shuo with you, I doubt you could hold a candle to her. We shall see about that. If you have time for baseless assumptions, then you have time for resting and healing. I'm so relieved Lin is okay. And again, those Ouroboros people may have taken it easy on us. Why? What are they doing here in the first place? The Trails anime is about North Amia vs. Erebonia. That's cool. Steel Maiden we heard about is here. Yorg's warning was right. She must be unlike anyone we face ever faced. Iris and the others should be arriving soon. We've already accomplished what we set out to do. If you're going further in, please be careful. Alright. Um <clears throat> Anixi, is is the timed fight coming up? You know, the one we only have so many so many, so many minutes to do. Is that during this part? It's not here? Okay, thank you. I mean, the feeling I'm getting is we're gonna run into the seventh English Steel Maiden Lady, and she's gonna, and she's supposed to win, right? But I'm assuming that we can win. It, I mean, it may not even be like that, I, I don't know. Oh, she just killed us. Nice guard, idiot. Alright, so none of that here, got it. I wonder if it would reflect his, uh... If I beat the time fight, um, all the rest of the optionals are in the back. Interesting. Okay. Hey, there's level 72 for them. That's good. Alright, where are our chests? We got something over here. Voice Breaker. And another one of those. What is Voice Breaker? I'm just curious. 15% to lower enemy arts. Boo, I don't need that. That's for losers. You don't seem concerned about the three... Oh, are they enforcers? I guess I didn't really think about that. I thought... <laughs> I thought they were just like... You know, like, soldiers, essentially. Like, Ouroboros losers. You know, like Gilbert. <laughs> I mean, I'm sure they're strong. I'm curious who they are, but I figure they're just, like, new characters like this 7th uh, English. 
increased stress. Oops. Click. Yep. This one's going in my hinge comp compilation. They work under the Steel Maiden. It's not Mooks. So, wait, if they're. I mean, they basically are enforcers then, right? Bum, bum, bum. Oh, that seems better. 230. Wait. So we go from 672. Yeah, we'll give it to. We'll give it to Ellie. That's fine. Well, that's cool. Yeah, I'm really excited to see these new characters. This is uh, one of the more hype things going on. Should be very good. Die, bird. I mean, I don't think we have a chance against this uh, Steel Maiden woman, though. Please save us from these treasure chest messages. We're also out of ideas. Uh, it's a big slow plant. Got it. Wrecked him. You'll let the optional bosses clap you. Maybe I'll clap them. I am a god, after all. Unless it's like just. Ch I hate when the only way to win is just by like doing some cheese strategy. It just feels lame. If Trails to Azure, Azure is so good, where's Trails to Beezer? Stupid. God damn it. That was the dumbest thing I've read today. Ooh, another monster chest? Probably heal Grishia then. <laughs> Miss Yin. Let us heal her. Perfect. Lloyd's not full health. You say these things. I don't have any way to give CP to Tio, so that's not an option. I have no food. So we're gonna lose. Nah, I don't give a fuck. If we lose, we lose. You don't have your thing, girl. I believe. Oh, it didn't move into it. Fuck. God damn it, Ellie. They moved out, fuckers. Now she's muted. The plants are fucking annoying. But this is a monster chest, so there's no option, sir. You're fucking muted. Alright, just kill the plant then. Wait. Why didn't that kill it? Usually hitting petrified shit kills them. I told you, Annexy, this is a monster chest. There's no option to skip it. God damn it. Defense 3. Lloyd's Brave Smash is just the bump system is just the bump system on fire. 
the fuck's a bump system? Oh, from east or whatever? Changed my mind. Yeah, I mean, I don't use that. Def defense is for cowards. Bum, bum. Did I get the one over here? I did. As soon as I see a thing to heal, that means it's boss fight time. Mina. You got the pre-stress? Yeah, I put it on Ellie already. Pay attention! <clears throat> Not my dad. Thank God. God damn it, Ellie! My controller made her face the other way at the last fucking second. Mm, this is a problem. Alright, that's better. That fixes the problem. Die thingy. Ikuzo. Could we get another? Eh, it's a thousand XP. We don't need another level. And our final chest. Celestial Bomb EX. Nice. And trails in the chest. Boo. There it is. It's boss fight time. Know what that means. Tiu's coming in. And... Oh, still blue, please. Or do we want a Grail Locket? Ugh. Alright, let me scroll down. Hold. Oh. In easy mode? Nah, I got it. I mean, we can just kill this. It doesn't seem like there's anything crazy about it, so we're just we're just gonna kill it. I mean, I, I imagine easy mode for me is gonna be using S crafts and then cast with my girls and then it's dead. So that's about that's about all I do, and it wins. All right, let me use the bathroom real quick, and then I'm going to clap this boss, whatever it is, and do more story. BRB. Let's get it. Ugh. Let me eat a couple chips. Slow night tonight. Nobody's really here that watches usually. Ow. Mm -mm -mm. Very sad for them. Oh, there's always the VOD too. <laughs> Okay. For us Americans, it is the day before Thanksgiving, so I imagine it's a busy night for for uh, them. Or for us. Okay. Tactics. Good enough. Fuck it. 
Time to end this thing, person. Whatever we're fighting. What? What is this place? It is incredible. I can detect immense energy gathering in this location. That's not all that's here. Oh shit. Oh, there's our new lady too. I find Campanella so interesting because he's an enforcer, but he's always like with the Anguis and like reporting to the Grand Master and stuff. It's just, it's interesting. <laughs> this is quite the magnificent venue, isn't it? If it's this lively, it should almost be time for the main event, right? This is a problem, these three together. <laughs> Perhaps so. It's bound to make for a magnificent spectacle. Were the Faceless still alive, I've no doubt he'd be savoring these developments. He's salt. Hopefully you will be too soon, you bowl cut motherfucker. <laughs> no doubt about that. Then again, who knows how out of hand things might have gotten with both of you coming to Crossbell. He probably would have requested the Glorious and drawn both Erebonia and Calvert's ire. Ah, makes sense why it's not here. <laughs> that's what that's he would have. Though it would have made for an interesting time either way. She's silent. Oh, is something wrong? Let me guess. Is this beneath you? You never were a fan of missions like these. Everything is according to the Grand Master's will. I have no objections. However, I will have to ask that you conclude your conversation, Campanella, Professor. It appears we have an audience. Yo, I like her armor, what the fuck? Now we anime. Now we anime. Uh huh? Y you three are... Would you look at that? More monsters than I expected to find when I came to this place. Huh? Oh, it's you. And after I went through the trouble to tie up those bracers so that no one would interrupt. I wonder how you all were able to find this place. No can do. I am under non-disclosure. <laughs> Sorry to interrupt your chat. Sounded pretty interesting. What kind of officers would we be if we overlooked whatever it is you're planning? Hmm. You're that young and upcoming team from the Crossbell Police, I presume. That would be the special support section to you. And you all would be from the Society of Ouroboros. Before we go any further, I'm going to need you to confirm your identities. Our identities? What's this boy going on about? Well, he is a police officer. If this... Is this what they call standard procedure? <laughs> this is a first, but you're out of luck if you think we can confirm anything to our adversaries. Or if you think we'd confirm anything. You strike me as an honest young man. It pains me that I cannot answer such an earnest question. Oh, is she, is she gonna be all about, like, honor and shit? I could see that. It was worth a shot, Lloyd. Common sense ain't gonna get us anywhere with these guys. It would be safer to consider these people like you did the cultist. Please, being placed in the same category as those buffoons isn't amusing at all. Very well. If the others won't, then I'll take it upon myself to make an introduction. F. Novartis. I serve as Ouroboros' sixth anguis and head of the 13 factories. You can simply address me as Professor, though. So, that was your doing then. The development and implementation of that code used to hack the Orville network, I mean. What's this? You're familiar with it. That would be my astral code. It's the basis of the society's... Professor. Professor. Uh, pardon me. 
though you do remind me of a girl I heard about that was a cult test subject. The Epstein Foundation took her in, as I recall. How about it? How would you like to utilize those talents for the society? You would do rather well with us, you know. Absolutely not. <laughs> Tio, always blunt. <laughs> Just how desperate are you? Ren leaves us, and now you're constantly trying to find a replacement for her. What happened with Ren has nothing to do with this. Are you quite finished? Allow me to address our visitors. Oh shit. Um. Arian Rod. Okay. Arian Rod. You may call me Arian Rod. I am Arabar's seventh Anguis, the Steel Maiden. It's a pleasure to make your acquaintance. Don't think I've ever heard that name before. Arian Rod. Uh, I wasn't expect such a, expecting such a serene voice. I don't know what I was expecting. But it wasn't a proper lady under all that badass armor. Listen, this proper lady is like the strongest fighter in Ouroboros, I'm assuming. Which only serves to make that intimidating air about her even more pronounced. So, you're the society's strongest, then. It's obvious that you possess a formidable, formidable fighting spirit. However... Uh... Rishia, now's not the time. I wonder how long you'll be able to maintain your composure before the might of Yin. Damn, she fucking wants to challenge her right now. Shit, just shook my old desk. Y Yin, what are you doing? Oh, why are you provoking them? Well, I wouldn't mind seeing a, he a heavyweight bout like this one, like that for myself. Sorry. I think you all have another problem to worry about. This place's guardian just came back. What? Guardian? Confirming massive aura approaching. Large cryptid incoming. Aw, oh, fuck. We don't even get to fight them? Seriously? Where from? Oh my god, it's a big fucking thing. What is this, a, a griffin? No, not a griffin, I don't even know. It's a lion with wings. Damn it! What is that? Oh, chimera, yeah, that's the word I was looking for. The Sphinx Chimera Cryptid. Could it be the Divine Flower gar Flower's Guardian that was created with ancient illusions? My oh my. Who knew something like that would materialize, too? Haha! <laughs> this gives me even higher expectations for the project! Interesting. Bum Kah! What the hell? Why is it only targeting us? Cut the chatter! We must strike this beast down immediately! It's not straight to the fight, alright! Yeah, that's Ouroboros just chills and watch Aegis to attack first. Alright, 3200 to Ellie already. We know what we gotta start with. Good old scan. Alright, no immunities or anything it looks like. 54k! Motherfucker. Sphinx Chimera, the cryptid... A cryptid in the shape of a lion. The shaking of its mane distorts space and time. Alright. Well, I wonder if we should get some. We got some buffs we can do. Strength. Uh, let's do this one first, real quick. Um, I really wish it was Lloyd's turn so he could give us a strength buff. We'll just have Randy do La Forte, though. She's gonna be doing some spark dines. I hope it's not an AoE attack that he does right off the bat. Okay. Alright, we buffed. 
Rewards Heaven's Eye. Goodbye, Eagle Eye. Yes. Alright, let's just start with the old Randy Lloyd special. It's not immune to defense and art defense down. You are correct. Yeah, we'll probably do that with Tio then next turn. So much this is for. Sixty-six hundred. Preparing to cast arts. Oh baby, thank you, Wazi. Oh oh shit, and we got the burst. Here. Um, we need to interrupt that problem. Is it on her? Is there a way to tell if it's interruptible or not? I mean, hopefully we can impede it. With Lloyd. But we could just be safe. First on the last turn. I kind of just want to move her. Oh, it does cancel enemy stuff. I forgot about that. Oh, shit. Hell yeah, then. Crimson Ray. Ah, oh, she can't go ahead of her, though. Um, I think we'll just do another Randy and uh, Lloyd Burning Rage. And we get another turn. Smack it, Lloyd. Sixty-one hundred. Dude, Ellie's fucking disgusting, man. That <laughs> it's so hard. All right, Randy, you need to do the burst. Then. Oh, we don't have burst. Oh no, we have fucked up. I repeat. Well, we might have to use Tio's thing then. Because I fucked up. Delay. Mm. I think better safe than sorry. We'll just zero feet. Just because I don't know how hard this is gonna hit. And I thought I was gonna cancel it, but my burst went away. I know that cancels her cast, but... What to use, what to use. Oh, it's just a diamond dust? Oh, get countered, idiot. It... What one-shots itself? Which attack one-shots itself? <laughs> the diamond dust? Okay. So don't get hit by diamond dust. Dude, Ellie is disgusting. <laughs> I guess attack twice. That's gonna suck if he uses the AoE here. Uh, let's just spread out a little. Oh, that's some bullshit. Alright, well. Where's my impede? Spark cast her really fast. Yeah, Tio hasn't done anything this whole fight. <laughs> Alright, at least he can be impeded. But, I mean... It's whatever. They're pretty much done for us. Oh, I stole... Hell yeah. 
want to see if he's gonna cast here. I want to save my burst. Get countered, idiot. Let's just do it. Fuck it. Later, bitch. You're dead. Very easy, very easy. But a bum 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 Well, hopefully that was it. I didn't really think about saving anything. Bum bum. Heaven's eye. Okay. Ugh. <sighs> Manage somehow. <laughs> God damn it, Kampana. <laughs> I'm impressed. Hmm, not bad for amateurs. I'll admit I may have underestimated the power of the Foundation's orbital staff. It intrigues me. Hmm. Arrogant bastards. Ouroboros. Give us our answers. What are you planning to do in Crossbell? Don't tell me... Don't tell me you're the ones who started manufacturing Gnosis again. What? Huh. <laughs> Why? Because that delinquent gang's leader got de demonized. I was lucky enough to see it for myself. It was quite the show. If he'd push it a bit farther, I'd be tempted to invite him to join Ouroboros. Damn. Hmm. Don't dodge the question. Answer me. Thinking us evasive, officer. Well, I can hardly blame you for that. After all, we didn't come to talk, but to evaluate the progress of the plan. We must make sure that the septium veins have been properly stimulated for the promised day. The promised day? How vague can you get? I've grown tired of this. If they won't talk, then we'll get our answers by force. Yen. He has a point. There might not be another way. Oh shit. So uncivilized. Thank you, Obi-Wan Kenobi. You want to fight, do you? I can't say fighting you myself sounds fun or fair. What if I let you handle this instead? If I must. Oh shit. Yo, look at that fucking- it's a lance? She- <laughs> God damn! She is sick looking. A spear- I mean, I, I would more call it a lance, but a, a spear, I guess, works too. A... spear? Oh. Well, thank you, Ellie, for correcting him. No, it's more like a lance. They were primarily used by knights of the Middle Ages. Someone met Arianrod? Arianrod? Yeah, she is, uh, she seems sick. I want to see her without her, uh, helmet on. I bet she looks, uh, I bet she looks nice. <laughs> Alright, they are primarily used by knights in the Middle Ages. What's up, Saivo? Glad you could come by. Talk about a blast from the past. What is she doing fighting with something like that? Yeah, what what is her deal? She seems very like old like nobility, like Middle Ages stuff. Do not waste your breath. You may come at me with whatever weapons you're most comfortable with. And do so with all of your might. <laughs> She's a badass, oh shit. Otherwise. Your lives will be forfeit. Uh huh? Incoming! Oh shit! Oh, we got fuck. Hey, Rishi is still standing, but we got fucked up. She's the reason I couldn't send you the Luve manga. Ah, yeah, cause she like sparred with him, right? 
She said Luve was like the only one that she enjoyed fighting or something. Which is crazy. And she fucked us up. How the hell? There must have been dozens of thrusts in a single breath. That is impossible. It exceeds human capability. Oh, what's this? How surprising that anyone could withstand the Steel Maiden's lens. If you haven't noticed, she's kind of powerful. Luve's mentor. Got Grandmaster give him the blade. Yo, Rishi is the, like, the real deal too though, right? I mean, I don't think she can take Aryan, Aryan Rod on here. God, she's got an awkward name. Aryan Rod? Aryan Rod? I'm not sure the, the emphasis is. But Rishi is strong. But, I mean, we knew she was strong. Alright, not surprising that anyone could withstand the Steel Maiden's lens. <laughs> They don't call you the Demon of the Eastern Quarter for nothing. Your reflexes are commendable. However, compared to your familiar predecessor, it's obvious that you still foster some hesitation. Ooh. She knew the pr predecessor. How do you... Is her mask gonna break? Oh, shit! Uh-oh. <laughs> oh, no. This is how the reveal happens. Huh? Uh, huh? Oh? No way! Appreciate. Incredible. Were you concealing your form this entire time? <laughs> well, color me surprised. Who would have ever guessed that Yin's true identity would be the illustrious co-star of the Ark and Seal, Rishia Mao? Shit's getting real, real fast. Yeah, dude. <laughs> oh, man. Uh-oh. Rishia, you got some splaining to do now. Don't you just love it when the drama on the stage pales in comparison to the real thing? I wonder... Do you guys think it would have been better if this was the first reveal of who she actually was rather than the scene in Zero? I mean, regardless, it is how it is, but I'm, I just, I'm curious if this wouldn't have been a better reveal. <clears throat> Alright, don't you just love it when the drama on the stage pales in comparison to the real thing? Huh. Is everyone okay? Would have been sick, I can't lie. Yeah, I think, I think this would have been maybe better, but... It's okay. I mean, this is still this is still sick. Oh, there's Arios. Oh, and we got Scott and Wendell too. Okay, okay. Noel, Arios, Scott, and Wenzel too. You came after all. Oh, I want to see Arios versus this woman. Oh shit. Arios and uh, Rishia versus Arianrod. You came after all. Oh fuck. Yeah, it's got me wanting to get out of my chair right now. These three must be... They're from Ouroboros. Oh, shit. It's Arios. And others. <laughs> Saibo. <laughs> Campanella the Fool. Along with the head of the 13 factories and the Steel Maiden herself. So Arios is aware of the Steel Maiden. Arios is very knowledgeable about all this. I take it you must be the Divine Blade of Wind. I've heard a lot about him. Supposedly, his skills are on par with Luve's. Alright, that's sick. I don't believe we've had the pleasure, Divine Blade of Wind. Indeed, your reputation precedes you. That's enough flattery. It means nothing coming from someone whose power is inhuman. Even an army would be forced to retreat when pitted against that lance of yours. You needn't sell yourself short, simply recognizing that it is that is an accomplishment in its own right. Uh, Arios? Are you telling them we, we came all this way just to let them go? No. However, the balance is not in our favor. Simply have a look around us. Ugh. 
Oh shit, it's the other three. Okay. Female knight. Arios is a badass, man. He's like su the super perception he's got here. Ugh. These must be the ones that Lin and Aeolia fought. Ugh. I can't find a single opening. Noelle, you're out of your league here, girl. That's enough. There is no need to go any further. Understood. Yes, my lord. Alright, none of these ladies are looking familiar, so they must all be new, brand new characters. As you wish, my lord. Damn. Oh. I believe that's our cue. Yes, we've confirmed the plan's progress and the stimulation of the Steptium veins. Haha! <laughs> I should be returning to give my masterpieces the finishing touches. Stop! Don't think we can let you escape. A word of advice, if you would. Our plan calls for us to play a supporting role here in Crossbell. To only play a supporting role. Huh? What? Soon the beasts will be set loose, and chaos will sweep across this land. Be that as it may, do not allow yourselves to be blinded by the tragedies yet to come. Have a good day, rest of your day, everyone. <laughs> I trust you'll wait with bated breath for our next encounter. Fucking ominous. Man. Shit's just happening. Ugh. Ouroboros. What a bunch of maniacs. Hmm. Yeah, look at Rishia. Rishia? Rishia. I should be going. I need to get ready for tomorrow night. <laughs> Please excuse me. We're not going to talk about this, Rishia? <laughs> Alright, later. <laughs> Novartis really walked into the barber and asked for the 10th century peasant. Yeah, he just, he wanted that, you know, that, that bowl just placed on the head and, and cut around. That's it. That's it, Ran. <clears throat> it's been, been one unbelievable thing after another. I'm starting to feel like this is a bad dream I can't wake up from. Yeah. I do not believe even dreams could concoct something this unbelievable. Yeah, maybe so. Considering what's happened to Wald, too, I would call this a nightmare. Risha's kind of fucked up right now. <clears throat> yeah, I mean... I still... I, I guess I'm not 100% sure what her goal here was. Like, it, she's still working for Heiwei, right? Like, what are they having her do? Just look into this stuff? The... The cryptid stuff, or what? <clears throat> Make no mistake. This is a reality we've been- we've been dealt. Arios. Ouroboros left us with more clues than I thought they would. Especially as to the importance of this place and the beast they claim to, will be unleashed. We need to begin preparing how to respond. R right Beast, huh? Don't tell me she meant... Uh, uh huh It looks like there's still an orbital signal out here. Yes, though just barely. A special support section, this is Banning's. It's Dudley. I heard that you were headed to the Lake Southern Bank. Are you there now? Th that's right. A lot happened, though. We just met up with Arios and the other bracers. That's perfect. Forward this information to them, too, since they're with you. Every single member of the Red Constellation up and vanished from the city. Why? What? I want to talk about this with Orlando face to face. Can you get back right away? Uh, understood. What's going on? That didn't sound like good news. It wasn't. Lloyd relayed to the group what Dudley had told him. 
Azure finally getting into gear? Yes. Finally, man. This is what I've been waiting for. But I swear to God, if tomorrow, if the next next segment is another day of just doing like five goddamn sp support requests, I'm gonna be tilted. <laughs> but hopefully it's not. <clears throat> no way. Red Constellation vanished. Michelin 2. Seven side quests, no! I swear to god, if it... Whatever, whatever. We'll just keep playing regardless. You get to oil up y Yinxia. <laughs> I like that name for her. I mean, if that if that's the side quest, Taivo, then we welcome it. Damn it, we were keeping tabs on them too. Lloyd, do as he said and return to the city. We'll take care of investigating this area and go back once we're finished. Uh, okay, we'll take you up on that offer. Appreciate it. No worries, we're all in the same boat here. Besides, Lynn and Aeolia still need some time to recover. If the Red Constellation has taken action, then Heiyue won't be far behind. We'll be back as soon as we can. Be extremely careful, SSS. Right. Excuse us, then. Okay. <laughs> Back to sad, mellow music. Remember Ravash? Barely. <laughs> Remember when Ravash was our problem? <laughs> I can't believe Yin, and Re Yin was Rishi all along. I was positive that Yin was a man. I wasn't. <laughs> She must have been doing something to disguise her appearance when she was in that form. Whatever it was, it seemed like she could even change the shape of her body. She just wore, wore really baggy clothing, Wazzy, that's all it was. Oh, remember when Ravash up and disappeared? Remember when Josette was our chapter baddie? <laughs> Those were the days, man. Those were the days. Is that humanly possible? Then again, we've been coming across plenty of people that are anything but normal lately. Yeah, no shit, man. A bunch of weirdos around here now. I would like to think that it was not just our mental stress at the times we have crossed paths with Yin that caused the confusion. Actually, you do not seem very surprised about all of this, Lloyd. What does it mean? Like, ah, I knew it all along. Yeah, it's because I'm not. A little... Oh, yeah, the conversation in the uh, hotel in Michelin. A little while ago, I had a conversation with Risha. Ever since I was little, it has been my reason for living. It's the same path my ancestors have walked throughout history. And now, I no longer understand where the path is leading me or why. It's leading you to the power of friendship, Risha, with the SSS. Accept it. Become our family. It crossed my mind at the time, but I had to be crazy. I thought, but I thought I had to be crazy. I simply put it in the back of my mind after that. I mean, obviously her true path is with Ark and Seal and Ilya and Sully, probably. But it stayed there. I couldn't entirely dismiss the possibility that she was really Yin. Interesting. Remember when we weren't bogus bracers? <laughs> well, hot damn. That'd explain how a total amateur came out of nowhere to become an Arkan Seal co star. Her true path is into Ilya's Pantsu. Yeah, though the story of how Ilya scouted her out of nowhere made it sound like it was just a twist of fate. Then again, Yen and Rishia's arrivals in Crossbell did line up perfectly. I should have pieced it together sooner. I wonder if Kao and the rest of Heiyue know her true identity. I imagine there was no one she wanted to keep that from more than them. Her contract told her knowing her full family lineage could only be to her disadvantage. I thought that, I hadn't thought of that. That puts us in an awkward position. We should be very careful about who we tell this, this to. I agree. For now, let's talk it over with the chief and see how the situation progresses. 
This doesn't change the fact that the Red Constellation is our top priority at the moment, not Heiwei. For sure. Uncle and the others are nowhere to be found. Trust me, that ain't good. Probably means they're finishing prep. They could strike at a moment's notice. Right. We should contact Commander Bales to get her up to speed too. I just don't know how the Red Constellation plays into, like, the Ouroboros stuff. Like... I thought they were just there because Erebonia paid them to be there. And to, like, show that they were better protection of Crossbell than the C than the police and all that. And to protect, uh, whatever his name is from Erebonia. Osborne. Excuse us. There you are. Or there you are. Huh, <sighs> took you long enough. Bitch, we came from across the state! Sorry about that. We had other business to take care of first. Well, it's the skinny. Exactly as I told you, the building has been completely vacated. In total, there should have been about a hundred people working here. We believe they vacated without us noticing by going through the geofront. The entire building staff went through the geofront? I do not recall there being a geofront entrance connected to this building. And that's correct, or rather, it wasn't until they used explosives to make one for themselves. Jesus. We found a path that leads to the lower stratum of the geofront B sector. They blew a hole into the geofront? You gotta be kidding me. They really are out of their minds. That's not the most troubling thing we've found here. They remodeled Ravash's old warehouse that stored smuggled weapons. Now it's a maintenance and training facility for heavy artillery. Uh, sounds exactly like something Uncle and the others would do. The, the Corps' credo, credo calls for being battle-ready at all times. They set that kind of stuff up to stay sharp. That lines up. I'll be frank, Orlando. Do you know what their objective is? Is it to settle their score with Heiwei? Or do you think they could target the station or airport? I'm out of that game, so I wouldn't know. That said, if Heiwei was their target, I don't think they'd pull this hide-and-seek act. As for the station and airport, I hate to break it to you, but they could probably take either of them without breaking a sweat. If they're going this far, they've got something crazy up their sleeve. You do not think they are trying to... It couldn't be Orcus Tower, could it? Were they trying to occupy it? I wouldn't put it past them, but I don't think that's it either. Something that showy isn't their style. It also wouldn't be their arena of choice. Arena? What do you mean? Yeagers are best suited for stuff like guerrilla warfare, not tight, enclosed spaces like a building. If they had their pick, they'd go at their enemies somewhere where they can use the terrain to their advantage. So, mountainous areas or whole townscapes. Places that have a lot of changes in elevation. Hmm. Right, the tower would be too confined. It would also take any vehicular weaponry out of the equation entirely. In that case, what about... First Investigation Division, Dudley speaking. Chief, good timing. Hmm. What was that? What's happening? This can't be good. Uh-oh. D- Dudley, what's the matter? The First Division was contacted by the CGF. An unidentified armed group has appeared on the Mains Mountain Path. The CGF unit patrolling the area has already been wiped out. Oh, fuck. I mean, it could be the Jaegers, though, right? Huh? Well, fuck. I don't know where- <laughs> I still have no cl Ooh, one hour earlier. I have no clue where the story's going still. I mean, obviously Ouroboros has a plan. Alright, this is HQ. We have a message for the third company. No time to think. We must keep going. The armed group's goal is unknown. There's a strong chance it's those Jaegers, the Red Constellation that vanished from the city. 
prioritize the safety of Maine citizens. This is the third company, roger that. As for that armed group, we'll... Fucking landmine or some sh- God, they're dead as fuck! An orbital mine? Oh yeah, they're dead dead. D-E-D, -E -D, dead. Damn it, all personnel to your battle stations! Oh, they got out, they're fine, they're fine. Oh, they're not f they're not fine. Alright, who the fuck's attacking? Oh, this has gotta be constellations, right? Huh, y'all are reacting pretty fast. Yep. It's been, what, three months since I got to bust it out? Testarossa's absolutely starving to eat up some hapless fools. Is that what she names her gun? Testarossa. I like Shirley, even though she's crazy and evil as fuck. Ugh. <laughs> Who are these nutjobs? Let's take out the trash. Drive them back through the tunnel. <laughs> Saiba. And slaughter anyone who tries to fight back. Yeah, she's fucking crazy. Ja! Ja. Poor CGF. They got fucked up. So, I, I mean, I still, I gotta know what they're doing. Like, why? God damn, just fucking slaughtered, dude. Just a strawberry jam, don't worry. Jesus. Shoot the rockets! Your orders, Commander! Oh, right. Standing around here is boring. Let's have a little fun. This way. Jaw. Follow the Commander's lead! Come on, Testarossa. You got prey to hunt. It's a fucking, uh... <laughs> it's a Lancer from Gears of War, is what it is. It's a gun that's a chainsaw. <laughs> We're gonna have a blast. Warhammer 40k? Space Marine? I don't know anything about Warhammer 40k. We're gonna have a blast. Poor CGF, dude. Brack, brack. Ah! All dead. Take cover behind the car! <laughs> Like that'll save you. Oh shit! She is badass. But I hate that she's evil. But it's still badass. She, she's a monster! And some Ren energy? It really is. Yo! Hell yeah! <laughs> Zach's got a new fetish. It ain't new. <laughs> it ain't new. Time to end stream? Okay. Bye, guys. We're not fucking leaving! We're staying. You guys better be careful. Oh, Grace is pissed. They told her she can't be here. Did they just kill half the CG? They killed a lot of them! <clears throat> Man. Who's the CGF? <laughs> so, but what is their point of this?
I mean, the red constellations could literally just take over Crossbell. Like, what? What's stopping them? I mean, also, what's the po what? Well, we know the red constellations hired by Erebonia. Is what is Calvard's response to this gonna be? Because surely they're not gonna let them take Crossbell or anything. Of course, even if that's not, like, would they let them do this even if it wasn't their objective? There's a lot of thoughts going through my head. I'm just going to keep playing the game. We're just, we're going to keep playing the game. Are they still under Erebonian contract? That's a good question. I don't know. But, I mean, Jaegers... Okay, they're under someone's contract, because they wouldn't be doing this of their own volition or whatever, right? Maybe Ouroboros is paying them now? It's very possible. Ouroboros has used Jaegers before. That's a, that's a good point, Saibo. I don't know. The plot thickens. The plot always thickens. I never get it concluded. It just gets bigger and more confusing. <laughs> Alright, but it's fucking hype. This is fucking hype. Maybe it's punishment? I don't know. Alright. Good goddess. I mean, it could be Anixi. Yeah, you're not wrong. There's a lot of options of what's going on. I just hope the game tells me. So we'll keep we'll keep going. To think a single group of Jaegers could wreak this much havoc. I believe we all know a greater force is at play than only them. See, the CGF is useless, like we said. It could be, but I mean, who the fuck can defend? against this strong of a Jaeger group. I imagine, like, even Libero's army would maybe have trouble. Then again, Libero has, like, an illegit army. And Cassius, so maybe not, but... They wouldn't have fun. Just as there was at the trade conference. Alright. You, th you think it wasn't the Imperial government? More specifically, it would it'd be the army's intelligence division, right? I won't deny that's the most likely possibility. We already know full well that one of their captains was at point of contact with the Red Constellation while in Crossbell. Cassius would kill them all with the toothpick? You think Cassius could take, uh, Sigmund or whatever his name is pretty easily? Is, so Cassius is stronger than Arios? Is that safe to say? Like, I, I still can't gauge where Cassius is on this strength chart, you know? I know he's a monster. I know he's a fucking monster in Divine Blade, but... Alright. We already know full well that one of their captains was a point contact with the Red Constellation while in Crossbell. Cassius, Luve, and Arios are all on the same page? Okay. Is Or that's how you see it? Gotcha. So... Mm, that's it. So, Arian... Arianrod, or whatever her name is, is the strongest character we've met up to this point. From Is what I'm gathering. That, that knight chick. Yes. Okay. It's fucking sick. I love that it's it's just a badass woman too. It's fucking awesome. I love it. I hope she ha she looks cool, like with her mask off. All right. If that's the case, wouldn't it be wise to beg the imperial government for mercy? Or better yet, we can plead with the republican government to aid us. As it so happens, I already confronted the imperial government about the red constellation earlier today. They chose to feign ignorance. Interesting. Interesting. Arianrod probably could take out all of the Red Constellation on their own. <laughs> yeah, she seems crazy strong. It's so cool. I love it. How the fuck- How the fuck are we gonna ever deal with that? There's no way. There's just no way. They choose to feign ignorance. 
The responsibility rests with me after I proposed independence. As things stand, I'm in no position to appeal to the Republican government either. Yeah, Crossbell is in a hard spot right now. D don't say that. It, it isn't your fault, Mr. Mayor. <clears throat> Regardless, all the state government can do at the moment is issue a formal statement of protest. My primary concern remains the s safety of Maine citizens. The CGF was able to confirm the status of the village after requesting assistance from a civilian airship. There did not appear to be signs of looting. Yes, but the fact of the matter is that all of the village's citizens are being held hostage. Their food reserves won't last forever. There's no time to waste. I agree. We need to make immediate to take immediate countermeasures. Commander, how many how heavy were the CGF's losses? Significant, unfortunately, to both our guardsmen and our resources. What remains has already been deployed to the mountain path. Stretch thin. Let's remember, our foes are our war experts, but they're still hired professionals. They can be swayed by Mira. Let's just pay them more. We have all the money in the fucking world. Right? If we negotiate well, we can prevent the crisis from escalating. I'm asking the CPD to explore that possibility while simultaneously assuaging the fears of the citizens. <laughs> you guys. God damn it, you guys. Roger. Uh, of course, Mr. Mayor. I'll contact the guild and see what I can do. Like, um... At, at what point... With, um... At what point with, uh... Like, Ouroboros intervening with... Jaeger's possibly attacking a town of innocent people in a, you know, Crossbell as a whole. Um, with all this shit going on, like, where's, when does that Bracer Guild involve more than just the Crossbell Bracers? Like, when do they get people from all other nations to come in? Oh yeah, and Wald's going crazy somewhere, like, cracked out on drugs, or whatever it is. Like, and also, I mean, obviously the church is also here already with Rias, but certainly some of their, like, main people should be getting here to, like, stop this shit that's going on, right? Like, it seems like it's escalated to a national thing. Remember when Zack said Wald would reappear and redeem himself? Hey, it's still possible, Saivo. Yeah, here's what's gonna happen, Saivo. I'm calling it now. Wald is going to redeem him. We're gonna fight him another time, but then the SSS is gonna be in trouble, and Wald's gonna like sacrifice himself, and Wazzy's gonna be all sad about it and stuff afterward. But Wald's gonna sacrifice himself, redeem himself finally, <clears throat> and we'll all shed small trails tears. Wald will defeat the Red Constellation. I never said that. Never, never said that. He'll have to get off the demon crack first. He'll just have to power through it. You know, just like the Ravash guy did. Garcia, he fought it off. Alright. Let's continue this fucking shit show that is Crossbell. And see, see what's gonna happen. Because this... Finally, stuff is ramped up beyond my expectations, basically, already. So this is great. I was just expecting the Ouroboros plan. I wasn't expecting Red Constellation to fucking start murdering us. <laughs> then we got Walled also, yeah. Alright, the chief is late. At least we still got our precious daughter, Kia. I shouldn't be surprised considering what's happening, but still... Right. The meeting to discuss the next course of action at Orcus Tower must be running long. There's also the political side of things to consider, after all. Not to mention Wald. He couldn't have picked a worse time to go completely berserk. Yeah, what a coinky dink. Um, everyone? Since the chief isn't coming back, should we save the hot pot for later? 
Nah, he said to go ahead and start without him if he's late. You went out of your way to prep it again, Mikito. You can bet we're gonna chow down this time. But, but... Randy... Never mind the hot pot. Are you sure you're okay right now, Randy? You know, you can confide in us at times like this. <laughs> of course, I know that. I've already said it before. I cut ties with Uncle and the rest of them years ago. Crying over what my old crew is doing isn't going to do anyone any good. Best thing we can do is get some good grub in us and be rested. You gotta be ready for tomorrow, yeah? Well... Y yeah, you're right. You know what they say, you can't fight on an empty stomach. <laughs> we can always count on Randy's mental fortitude to help us through the worst of times. No arguments. Don't forget how much our little encounter south of the lake took out of us. Eating and turning in early is for the best, regardless of what will happen tomorrow. Yeah, I agree. Okay, let's start digging into these hot pots. Dude, I'm so hungry right now. Kia went out of her way to prepare all of this. There's plenty of meat, fish, and vegetables. We'll stuff ourselves and go to bed early. Yeah! Let's eat. Kia, don't worry about what's going on up the road and eat your fill. We'll take care of it. Okay! Make your own. I don't know how, Saibo. I don't know how. Fear not, Zait. I will save you some meat and fish for later. Grr, woof. Bork, 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 bork. The fuck's this guy doing out? Is he drunk? He's a drunk! All of our precious SSS members sleeping in their beddies. Someone's gonna be awake, aren't they? Randy. They skipped Randy! I knew it! Come on, Lloyd. Come out of your room. Stop him! Where the fuck are you going, Randy? Don't do this. Young man's voice. Who's a young man? Uh, going somewhere? Lloyd? Figures you'd be here. Oh, Wazzy! Oh yeah, they didn't show Wazzy, did they? Man, why the hell are you waking up so early? Then artillery hits the bell. <laughs> you fucking asshole. That's where you're wrong. I'm just getting back from my favorite bar. I have no right to judge you for keeping secrets. But I don't think the others are going to take you running away very well. True, Randy. Come on, Randy. How many times we gotta go through this bullshit? Quit the facade. Probably not. This is my problem, not theirs. Um, it's kind of all of Crossbell's problem. This ain't about Uncle or Shirley. Damn, that's a good song. Good-ass song. There's no way in hell I'd let Lloyd and the others put their lives in the line fighting my battles. So I'm going. To finish this fight on my own. That's the way it has to be. If you say so. You and Wald are the same. Are all men this stupid? Are you not a man, Wazzy? I mean, I don't care. But we all kind of assume this at this point. Why can't any of you just be sincere? Man, leave me a want loan, will you? I've been meaning to ask you this for a while. Which team are you on, anyway? <laughs> Something tells me you're not referring to my innocent little comments about men, are you? Something tells you 
Zach thought we were joking when we were saying Wazzy's best girl. I don't know! I mean, I don't care. It doesn't even matter. It's just Wazzy, you know? In that case, your guess might not be too far from the truth. You don't say. I thought you smelled like a few badasses I've crossed ba paths with back in the day. So are, so are we saying Wazzy used to be a Jaeger? Also? Guess that means you were playing dumb around that girl, too. I uh, don't know which comment he's referring to here. Uh, who who was sniffing him out? Was it Shirley? I don't know. <laughs> I wonder about that. Well, as thanks for keeping your mouth shut, I'll pretend like I'm in the dark tomorrow. Have fun going as wild as you'd like. Thanks. Oh, you won. Damn it, Randy. <sighs> Shit. With him gone, I'm not too confident in our combat strength anymore. Yeah, Randy was a big deal. This music's so sad, man. Ugh. Yeah, Wazzy might have to show his true colors, I guess. Oh, I think I might have to call Abbas for support. Interesting? Man, I still- I just want- I just want them to tell me. What is Wazzy's deal? Obvious- so he may have been in Jaeger. <clears throat> Damn it! A barrier to get over. This one. I went to go settle things once and for all. See ya. Fucking Randy, man. Why do you have to do this to us? This is bullshit. Come on, man. This cannot be happening. H how could he do this? Especially after what we spoke about last night. Damn it. He even left his enigma behind. Oof. Randy. No luck. No one in the neighborhood has seen him around. He must have taken off in the dead of night while everyone was asleep. But where could he have... Man, this song's sad too, dude. By settling things once and for all, does he mean mains? Yeah, I can't think of anywhere else. Should I contact the guardsmen dispatched on the mountain path? I wouldn't count on it. Chief. Sheesh. It took him going stray for him to finally clean his room up for once, I see. We're <laughs> such a genius sure the SSS won't follow you. Yeah, this is not the play, because no matter where he went, the SSS is going to go there now. Regardless of how dangerous it is, they gotta get their their fucking friend back, their family, you know. Randy's just like he's had some issues, man. Randy doesn't feel he deserves the SSS. I mean, I know, but I I thought we'd been through this. I thought we were past this, like. Randy, we know we know everything about Randy. We've accepted him. We've told him this. That we're here as a family, as a group, together, we go through all these things. But he's still fucking left. It's just, I don't know, man. I mean, I get it. But we're, hopefully, we're gonna get him back. Hopefully he's okay, too. I've already contacted the CGF, but they haven't spotted him either. I can only assume he's take, taking an alternative route up to Mainz. Never forget that he's a former veteran Jaeger. Don't think he's gonna have trouble staying out of the CGF's line of sight. Well, 
yeah. Yes, though, I thought he trusted us more than this. Hmm. I am. I'm like, I'm very sad that he... It's like sadness. There's some disappointment in what he did. You know, some anger, I guess, too. Frustration that I'm not gonna have fucking Randy for what I'm ever I'm gotta do next, you know? And I'm also some confusion with the Wazis deal still. Can't wait to figure out what his deal is, like, finally. And Wazi confusing me, as usual, but in more ways than one, I guess. <laughs> I think the best thing to do is observe the situation for now. Jaegers practically have the home field advantage in the mountains. First we have to go find lost cats and return library books. I swear to fucking god, if we have to do all that. <laughs> god damn it! Jaegers practically have the home field advantage in the mountains. Even if we chased after him, I doubt we'd be able to catch him. No. Uh-huh. I doubt Randy left for Mains overnight. I wouldn't rule him out still being in Crossbow City, even. What makes you say that? What? What makes you think that? Oh no, am I just on Noelle's page? No! It's simple. If Randy was seriously about to combat the Red Constellation, do you think he'd be able to do it with just his stun halberd? Oh. A valid point. Even he is not that brazen. You're saying he'd go to pick something up first. You're thinking he's looking to get something that packs a punch like back in his Jaeger days. Uh, like what? Hey, maybe Noelle's full of mysteries? No. No. Exactly. Damn. Sure wish I had that with me right about now. Oh, uh, yeah, what does he talk- does he have a special weapon? Just like, uh, Shirley's got her own special named weapon? That would be sick as fuck. Randy told me he used to use an incredibly strong- Oh, it's his rifle. Oh. Maybe it is the same thing. Or maybe it's literally the one Shirley has. I used to use an incredibly strong Orville rifle when while he was in the Corps. I'd hazard a guess that he had it stashed away somewhere in Crossbell. Fair point, kid. Th then shouldn't we go to all the locations in the city he frequents? We may be able to determine where Randy has gone. Right, this seems like an idea worth trying. I was thinking the same. Hmm. What's wrong, Wazi? Do you think I made a miscalculation? No. <laughs> I'm simply surprised. I'm on board. Your explanation was convincing enough. If you think he's still in the city, where do you think he went? Right. First and foremost, I suspect the downtown district. Ashley, the owner of Nian Valley Exchange, is also an arms dealer. Giyami seems like he'd... He'd be knowledgeable when it comes to heaven weaponry as well. There is also Drake, the owner of Barca Casino. He could know something too. Randy was always there wasting the night away. Good idea. Hasn't Randy known him since he first came to Crossbell? <laughs> Orlando, you poor sob. Or, uh, yeah. Son of a bitch. You should have known better than try to shake the SSS. You're already hot on his tail. <laughs> Aww. <laughs> you got that right. We have to be. As the leader of the SSS, I'm not going to turn a blind eye to selfish defection. <laughs> we'll pinpoint his location and drag him back here by the collar if we have to. Naturally. We'll even put him in cuffs if that's what it's going to take. Will Randy be okay? No. We'll see to it. I promise we're going to bring him home. You don't need to worry. So wait patiently here with Zite for us, Kia. Okay. Lloyd, everyone, be careful out there. Bring Joshua Randy home. Oh god, it really is the same! No! I could tell at the exact moment you were like, no, that's stupid, it's son of a bitch. <laughs> yeah. 
It was pretty obvious, yeah. <laughs> Off to the casino in the entertainment district in the two shops downtown, yeah? Right, there could be clues lying in other places too. Unfortunately, we don't have time to go outside the city right now. On the bright side, we did not receive any new support requests this morning. Yes! Best news all day! That gives us more time. The lack of request is probably due to what happened yesterday. HQ is still in utter disarray. I've heard CGF has suffered losses too. Forgive me, Noel. Considering your position, I'm sure you're taking that news much harder than we are. No, it's okay. Guardsmen are ready for this kind of thing. More importantly, I'm a member of the SSS right now. Just like Randy, let's go bring him home. Right. Suffered losses, brother. And <laughs> entrails are painting the main mountain path. True. Anxiety says, "Oh, feed cop. Uh, yeah. I guess we'll get another attack three. I suppose. Might as well. No, we don't really need any more. Bean crab." Yeah, fuck it. Let's get it. Fuck it. Feeding the kitty. Thank you. Oh my. Oh my, another quartz. We're so shocked that he comes back with one every time. Um, I guess we could... Should we... Should we go... I know Wazzy's a caster, but should we just hit him up with the passionate Rouge right now? So that way he's actually useful. Luckily, I think I've been keeping his weapon up to date, so he's... God damn, even with the two trinkets, he still has less strength than Lloyd. Oh, he'd probably, probably have no cords on him. That's the problem. Where the fuck is the cat getting those? Just <laughs> literally just stealing them from the the shop or some shit, probably. <laughs> Fucking cats. Mm, we just give them a bait too. Oh yeah, we got a heaven's eye, right? Let's use that instead. Wait. Oh, it says it has eagle's eye, right? Uh, I don't have an HP 3? Fuck! I don't have any actions. Fuck! Alright, whatever. Salamander? Yeah, maybe. My only concern is that in chap in the finale, I'm don't do not tell me. But my concern is with the way I'm doing courts and stuff. I've been gipping my support people, and I'm wondering if there's gonna be like a part where we have to use everyone, like it kind of like Sky the Third, where it splits us up. If that happens, I might not have enough courts at all. Uh, let's save here. Ah, uh, let's do another save file. Alright, um, since we got a whole day here, main story, I'm gonna make some tea and use the bathroom. So we're gonna take a very short break. It's very short. And I will be right back. Or I'm gonna start some tea. Because we're finishing this chapter tonight. So be ready.
Still waiting on the tea. Two mugs of tea, shit's getting serious. You know, yeah, you know that's when we're in for the, the long run, Anixie. Alright. The tea is... Or the kettle is on. I'm just gotta wait for it. You have vegetable juice? Oh, I see. Vegetable juice is disgusting. In my opinion. But that's just me. Alright, so I guess I'll see what I need to do next. Looks like there's some people we need to talk to. And then we'll start looking for Randy. But first, I eat some chips. How do I see this playing out? I... Uh, man, I really don't know. I think... Fuck, I... <laughs> I really don't know. I mean... How, and what do you want to give me... Give you the answer on? Overall the story, or just the looking for Randy thing? We're gonna, like, fuck, I don't know, man. I'm so... I don't, I really don't know what's going on. I think Ouroboros mentioned their plan is to, like, basically set monsters to attack Crossbell for some fucking reason. I don't know why. Obviously, they're trying to get a Septarian, but I can't understand how any of this leads to that. Like, with, um, Sky SC, um, you knew that the tower, right? The towers were, like, the locks to the Areola, basically. But, with this, I just, I don't know what the fuck's going on. And, I mean, Kia has to play into this somehow, but I still am not seeing her connection to any of this yet. Like, not really. I mean, obviously she's in the, the cult document things, and she's like the divine child. But man, this this story thoroughly has me... Um, like, I can't really guess what's going to happen. We'll see. There's my kettle, BRB. Controllers on it. There we go. Okay. 
<clears throat> now I just need to wait for my tea to sit here for a second. Damn, my phone is dead as fuck. I need to charge it. But I got crackers. Oh man. It's all crunched up. This pisses me off. Your dog shit on the rug? Oh, that's unlucky. Oh, that's disgusting. You're not done yet, ho. What, you, you expect me to be done, Panda? What the fuck? You know how long these games are, son? They're kind of long. Believe it? Mm hmm. This one got. Shit got real, man. Damn, you spent 80 hours? 70 to 80 hours? That's impressive. <clears throat> I thought you'd get it done faster. I'm, I'm actually shocked. It took me like 83, and I'm reading aloud everything. Farmed a lot at the end until it became too stupid. I see. Well, look who it is. Hey, SSS, thanks for yesterday. You're welcome. Are you two already back to work? Yep, it's all thanks to you guys. I'll give you lots of pats on the head as thanks later, my dear Tio. I politely decline. If you have the energy to fawn over me, then you should you must be feeling better. Yeah, but we can't push ourselves too hard yet. just realized, where'd that redhead of yours go? And this is his usual cue to chime in and not so subtly hit on Aeolia. <laughs> True. Looks like something happened between you guys. You want to talk about it? Actually, yeah. Lloyd and SSS explained that Randy had disappeared. Oh boy. I had a hunch something like this might happen since we found out the Red Constellation are the ones behind Main's occupation. Oh, 68. Okay, that sounds right. That sounds right. I had to go get my friend to try the vegetable juice. Did he hate it as much as I would? There's something horrible. Oh, you mean <laughs> there's actually something wrong with your juice? Oh no! <laughs> What's wrong with it? How will the Bracer Guild proceed? Ooh, a chemical s soap taste? Eww. Yeah, throw that shit out, dude. This sounds bad. How will the Bracer Guild proceed? <clears throat> The CGF's trying its best to push them back, so we'll wait and see. However, if the situation drags out any longer, we'll have no choice but to intervene. Isn't that right, Michelle? Jelly beans to fix it? Mmm. <laughs> Jelly beans. Correct. We might even need to bring in some A-rank or higher braces from nearby countries to help. That's what- Alright, I'm glad they're addressing this. Because I, I think they definitely should be doing that. Like, with citizens in danger, aren't the Bracers supposed to help regardless? Again, Trails says what Zack asks. Yep, he'll never escape. It's true. <laughs> it's always literally a few sentences later after I've asked the question. <laughs> they answer it. I love it. I fucking love it, dude. 
They, they, what, what is so good about the writing, man, is they never leave, like, big plot holes or, like, things unanswered. Like, oh, why didn't they just do this? They always have an answer for that, you know? And it's great. It's fucking great. Wonder what the Powerball is? <laughs> if only my luck and questions could carry me to that. If only. <clears throat> You'd go that far? Well, only in a worst case scenario. Arios is in the middle of discussing things with the mayor. If it looks like the CGF won't be able to hold out. Well, the Guild's Creed is to prioritize civilian safety, so of course you'll have to intervene. Go regardless, I'm worried about your red-headed friend, too. <clears throat> Don't know what's going to happen from here on out, but you best watch your, your keisters. Yeah, we will. Okay. Watch our keisters. Is, uh... Arios? I don't care about... Scott and Wenzel. No, fuck. What are they? What's he on the phone about? Glad everything's alright in Armorica. Of course, please tell the villagers to take shelter as a precaution. Ah, okay, I wanna. Alright, let me throw my tea bag away. Sorry. Gotta do that real quick. But a bum bum, but a bum. That was nasty. Sorry if you heard me spit right there. Blech. Love me some tea. I gotta remember, I need after the stream, I need to order more tea, because I'm running out. I got like a hundred bags a while back, right? And they're finally, I'm down to like single digits on how many are left. Okay. Yes, I will, Saito. Moral, great. I want to get some other type, too. You got any recommendations, by the way, Saito? Can't believe you used to shit on me for liking tea. No, 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 no. And I will still shit on you about liking cold tea. I hate cold tea, dude. Cold tea sucks. Hater? I am a hater of cold tea. Uh, like, the main reason I like tea is because it's a warm drink. Cold tea is great, take that back. Nah, it's not good. Panda's greater than Zack. <laughs> Oof. Oof. God damn it. It's two against one. This is bullshit. Where's my fellow tea haters out- cold tea haters out there? Race and rings, where are they at? There they are. Hey, it's the special sports section. You guys look like you've been through a lot in the last 24 hours. And this just randomly- Oh wait, no, I already asked you when you're starting Trails of Sky the Third. You said after Pokemon. Cold tea for meals, hot tea for tea time. Hot tea only. Period. Well, you guys look like you've been through a lot in the last 24 hours. Wait, isn't Randy? No. Where is he? He couldn't be. Hmm. Well. Sorry, Grace. We'll tell you all about it some other time. Let's go, everyone. Oh, then don't start it, because you're going to be playing that shit. You really like French vanilla or spiced apple chai? I see, I see. What's a Skinner box? I know I've heard the term before. Hey, wait, Lloyd. Listen here, I have no intention of following all of you out there, but how about I give you a word of advice? Excuse me? What do you mean by that? Let me 
me start off by admitting that I know a thing or two about Rainy's backstory. I don't mean to be rude, but I can't deny I was a little suspicious of him before. Stuff that stretches out player metrics, yeah. Irish breakfast is- oh, I did like Irish breakfast, actually. But you drink it with milk and sugar. How, how do you do milk and sugar, Saivo? So is, is the tea still brewed regularly and you just add milk and sugar afterwards? Or, like, how does the- I don't- Yep, okay. Interesting. Annex is rant ranting about hating WoW. And Panda says, Spiced Apple Chai is the shit, by the way. I see. Hmm. <laughs> you and Panda would get along great, Silo. I, I bet. God damn it. <clears throat> Alright. That said, I've also... I've also seen everything he's done with SSS, so I'm on his side too, and I and believe in him. Grace. Going by your reactions, I can piece together what happened. He's on his way to Mains by himself, isn't he? He's trying to resolve this whole mess himself. You can tell? She is not a reporter for the Crossbell Times for nothing. Damn Skippy! I nailed it, didn't I? And that means you and are all on your way back on your way to drag him back. Tell you listen to me if I told you not to. You guys have made up your minds, haven't you? Well, Annexy, I think that's a good idea. Adding old things to M plus. For now to go get chocolate milk to try and get rid of the taste. I still have a horrible Undercurrent of soap that's not. Ugh. That's disgusting, bro. You got some bad vegetable juice. Bleh. You guys have made up your mind, haven't you? Of course we have. Randy's our friend. That's right, we won't abandon him. Now I hear ya. In that case, you don't really need my advice. So I only got one thing to say to all of you kick some butt, SSS. And when you get back here with Randy, let me get an interview so I can write all about it. <laughs> Thanks, Grace. Um, okay, two down. Oh, we need to go get our crossbell times. We can just get that here. It's Blizzard, they'll execute it poorly. Well, duh, Blizzard's shit. Absolute shit. But everyone knows that. Crossbow times number six. Uh, let's let's skim it real quick. Our crossbow times issue number six. Sudden fire ignites armored car. Uh, they're just talking about the. Yeah, they're just talking about the attack. They still do the book collection for Ultimate Weapons in these games? Yes, they do. And it's still as impossible to get as the previous games, Darren. So guided up. Yep, I... You know, I... I hate using guides. I'm a, I'm a big proponent of the the joy of discovery, right, when it comes to video games, which you cannot get while using a guide, necessarily. But for tra Trails games, it is my exception, because of the different content you can get that you'd be missing out on otherwise. Not to mention broken-ass weapons from getting all the books. You know what developer doesn't suck? Falcom, maybe? Can you really name very many besides Falcom? Because I don't know. Capcom? Yeah, Capcom is actually pretty fucking good. I will- they- they were hitting a low for a while, but they have fucking- they have fucking brought it back lately. 
Doesn't know about recipe bonding and pom pom accounts. True. Or the deep DP in these games, goddamn. Arc Systems Works, yeah, they're fucking fire. They make do they only make fighting games though? Granted they're amazing, but Yeah. Yeah, Arc System Works is solid, dude. Remedy? What's remedy? Don't know about that one. Square Enix is still great? No. I would say Square Enix is... Has like 25% good. Square Enix has some a, a good section. It's the one team that's doing Final Fantasy 14, hopefully 16. And like... Them remaking their like old games is great. I like that a lot. But they go hard on mobile games and NFTs and shit. <clears throat> no, no, I'm a Square Enix fanboy, so don't get me wrong. I love Final Fantasy. Final Fantasy is up there as one of my favorite game series, and that's not gonna change regardless of how much I love Trails. But Final Fantasy will always be um, one of my favorites. No, oh, Annexy, it's Remedy, Remedy's Alan Wake and Max Payne. I haven't played any of those. Trainers is trash coming in trying to hold on to their... I would say they're putting out some other good stuff. Octopath is amazing, in my opinion. Triangle Strategy was really good that they released. Um, I don't know if there's much else that I've played by them. I love Final Fantasy VII Remake. That's It's amazing. FF14 is amazing, like, top tier game. Witcher 3 re-releases free with more quests. Then they screened to sell off something. Yeah, they did sell something off. Alright, anyway. I need to read through this. Uh, just the train wreck. Alright, this one wasn't that relevant to read. Other than they're not, like, confirming that it's, like, terrorists doing all this stuff. Okay, what's next? Arc and Seal. Let's do Arc and Seal. What's a better game, Cyberpunk or No Man's Sky? I have played neither of them. I heard Cyberpunk's actually good, though, after they fixed it. Wait, and so- and same with No Man's Sky. Wasn't No Man's Sky garbage at first, and then they, like, fixed it by, like, a bunch? No Man's Sky's pretty fun. I see. I haven't played it. I don't know that it's necessarily for me. It's just like a big sandbox, right? So. More fun with friends. Yeah, exactly. I have no friends. <laughs> Games will never live down their releases. Even if they have improved. Yeah, I mean, I agree. Cyberpunk's the biggest disappointment gaming's possibly ever had. <laughs> the way it shit the bed. I've never seen something so, like, go bad. Can't re recommend Witcher Trilogy enough, if only for the impactful story. Yeah, I know. I have pretty little interest in The Witcher, though. I don't know. I just don't know if it's for me. I'm just the family that never left. No. <laughs> Oop. <laughs> Hello, everyone. Yinjia. Well, if it isn't my favorite little guy in the game again. She never fails to say that, does she? It's always her favorite little guy. What are you guys doing here? Hmm. Rishia. It's good to see you, Rishia. Awkward. Some shooting in chess in Walmart. Perpetrator defines supermarket sword manager kills him. What the fuck? Why are you randomly bringing this up in in the chat? Kills himself. Wait, wait, was he the shooter? Hmm. 
Walmart broke someone. Man, I fucking hate- I hate guns. I absolutely hate guns. I hate it. <laughs> hey, so quit talking about feeling up solely, goddammit. What's going on? Did something happen between you and Lloyd- you, Lloyd and Re You and Lloyd, Risha? But No. Besides, we don't have much time until the performance. I'd like to review the scene prior to the- to the duet once more. Uh, so do I! I want to make sure I've got that part down pat. If you insist. Sorry, gang, unless there's something important going on, it's time for us to get back to work. Now's not the time for us to get distracted. S sure. Sorry to have interrupted you. Annex has a thing for Soli secretly. It's not no fucking secret at this point, man. <laughs> it's every time. Sorry, I have to focus on tonight's performance. Risha. Let's rehearse the scene where the Moon Princess arrives and chases after the two other princesses. Ready, Risha Soli? Yes, anytime. Ready whenever you are, Ilya. Alright, cool. Give Risha a hug, goddammit, Lloyd. She needs it. Lloyd's gonna give her the best hug she's ever gotten. Can't fool us now. It's over, Anixie. We know. Now we know. What is Natitia? Who? What? What? What's a Natitia? I don't even know. Oh, it's this bitch. She's just a reporter. Oh wait, that's the uh, the one reporter. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, the co-worker, the liberal reporter. She's just reporting. We know who Anixi said looked best in their swimsuit. You know he did mention that, didn't he, Saibo? Yo. Noticia is news in Spanish. <laughs> But that's just her name. <laughs> they literally just... <laughs> they use the word news in Espanol. I should have noticed that. I guess I didn't know the word for news. Noticia. My Spanish is doo-doo. Alright. Orcus Tower. Let's just do this. Is this rhymes? Nope. Just looks exactly the same. Muriel! Rare to see you in the city, second lieutenant. True, I just got here recently. At least she's not dead. I'm happy about that. <laughs> That's what Anxie said too! <laughs> I didn't read your comments until after. Oh, that's funny. I'm waiting on Deputy Commander. He's had a series of meetings with Commander Bales this morning. Chief Sergei was in the same meetings last night, too. If the two heads of the CGF are here, it must mean that the countermeasures in the mountains are not going as planned. What if I found out Muriel had got killed by Shirley in the mains? Then it all would have made sense why... Why Randy's gone. He's getting revenge. I bet Randy would fucking explode if that happened. Uh, about that, I spoke with your chief this morning. He told me Randy has disappeared. Yeah, we suspect he's headed for the Mains Mountain Path as we speak. I thought so. <laughs> Randy needs his favorite Sundere? You mean Dudley? <laughs> Are you okay? I'll be fine, more importantly. Randy running off has something to do with his past, doesn't it? The only girl in Crossville that hasn't fallen under Lloyd's influence. You know, you, you're goddamn- you're right. You're right. Well, as much as I wish I knew more, there's a lot about Randy's past that he never told me about. After all this time, I still don't know why Randy refused to use a rifle while he was in the CGF. Does not give him the right to run off like an idiot and worry, worry all of you like this? I'm sorry, Second Lieutenant. This is the most foolish thing he has ever done, and that is saying something. <laughs> True. Commander Bales, Ashley, okay, fair enough. Bell. Bell secretly wants him. 
Actually, nah. Belle just wants Ellie. If she was a straight woman, she would she would want uh, Lloyd, though. Belle talks tough shit, but she wants a threesome with it. Oh, you know what? You're right, Saibo. You're right. Hazel's sister, she's just keeping it to herself. <clears throat> CGF has suffered enough losses from the situation already. Commanders are likely devising a new relief force to take over. Until then, we're not going to be able to do much. We can't even deploy units before we're any away from there. So please, SSS, please drag that idiot back here for my sake. Aww. We bang Will's mom? Same. <clears throat> we, we will, Second Lieutenant. We're going to bring Randy back for sure. Sorry, I was, I was reading chat and I just started picturing... I don't even know what was going on in my brain for a second there. <laughs> We're gonna bring Randy back for sure. The show. Alright. Time to go downtown. And eat a cracker while I walk there. Oh. Mm-hmm. Exactly. Yeah, I was. I was think thinking of the logistics. <laughs> and also the fact that their mom is there. I get Fran in this equation. You can have Fran. That's fine. Mm. Alright, sorry. There's a bunch of trash. I had to throw that in the trash can. Okay. Putting them up, I threw them away. <laughs> Where's your nightly fruit snacks? Don't tempt me. I'll go get them right now. I can use them. Do it, bitch. Go get. Got one pack I ate on the way. Oh. <laughs> Fruit snacks are delicious. Eat one at a time. Black Forest. They're these Welch's ones. Boo. Oh, they're pretty good. I like them. Alright, where is Ashley? There she is. There you are. I had a feeling you kids would be showing up soon. Is that because Randy was here earlier? Yeah, he called me and came to pick up some things this morning. Black Forest with liquid centers or gold... Ooh, that sounds fucking good. Sounds like a fucking, uh, gusher or whatever they call it, you know? From back in the day. <clears throat> Kami came to pick up some things this morning. Told me to play innocent if you came around, but I don't take orders from him. They're like gushers, but a thousand times better. Oh, shit. I need to look these up. I could go for those. <laughs> Lucky us. In that case, what did Randy order? Was it an orbital rifle? No, nothing that plain. 
More like explosives, armor piercing rounds, grenades, and some old fashioned gunpowder ammo. Ammo? Ammo? God damn, he picked up a lot of shit. He cleaned me out, believe it or not. Oh, and an unregistered Enigma 2 that I picked up on the black market. That's not good. He's armed to the teeth now. Yes, and if he is using an unregistered Enigma, he knows he cannot be tracked. No, Anixie. Oh, he bought a bunch of ammo too? Yeah. Did I hear you right? He didn't buy any standard weapons? Believe me, I tried. I suggested a few of my best Orville rifles and gunpowder rifles. Suppose they weren't up to the spec for the next commander of the Red Constellation. Wait, she knew that about him already? I know he is. We won't... We don't forget, Anixi. We know about your... Your obsession now. It's over. <laughs> Ashley. So you knew. Ha! Of course I have. Information is my livelihood. Don't get me wrong, though. He's out to give them hell, not join them. That said... Remember the Red Ogre and Blood Sh Bloody Shirley are monsters in every sense of the... Of the word, excuse me. <laughs> and it is. <laughs> that Playboy former Jaeger is going to get slaughtered. Uh oh. It's not good. We will not let that happen. And that's why we're here, to stop that. They've been like this all day. Trying to scare them probably isn't going to work. Yeah, yeah, I can see that now. It's not my fault if that idiot gets himself killed out there. I'd rather not lose a loyal customer. Drag his ass back here, will ya? Of course. Thank you for the information, Ashley. Alright, next up... Gyome. And some fruit snack. Hey kids, what's what is going on with Randy? I can I can tell he's up to no good. I like how all these people like know Randy and that he's acting strange and all that, you know. You barged in here first in the morning asking me to do some crazy work. I had a feeling. Well, what what time this morning? Uh, around 5 a.m. I think. I was already pulling an all-nighter when he barged in to force more work on me. What about his request was crazy? Did he have that big weapon with him? Yeah, sure did. But the thing was pretty shot, let me tell you. It was falling apart. The thing hadn't been used in a while, so I gave it some tuning and maintenance. I even cleaned out the exhaust unit. That thing is nuts. Must be some kind of monster to wield a sucker like that. There's no mistake. It is the Orville Rifle used in the core. I wouldn't doubt it. Thank you for the information, Gyami. No sweat. I'm not sure what's going on with him, but I could tell he had something heavy on the brain. Y'all are his friends, so I hope you'll look out for the guy. Of course we will. Roger. Uh, now the casino. If no ill didn't ex exist, not nothing a plot would change. You're not wrong. That That is a very true statement. Very true. Poor Noel. Not enough milk. Alright, I know Drake has what we need. Hello, everyone. I take it you're here for Randy. Correct. I assume he was here earlier? Yes, he walked in here about 3 a.m. He drank for a bit and then left. He had his last drink at the bar. Then this was likely his first destination. 
We had to invent a trait for Noelle with the milk thing to stop her from being completely bland. It worked, though! <laughs> Alright, then this was likely his first destination. And did he say where he was off to? I see, he didn't return to the SSS, just as I expected. Wait, listen. Well, never mind. Never mind. Alright, no, he didn't specify any location. At least she's cute. Yeah, I mean, she's got that. At least it's not, like, random... What if it was, like, fucking a shitty dude? <laughs> Anixi out here talking about Soli again. God damn it. <clears throat> Alright. Though he was being more loose lipped than usual, he was drinking. He also retrieved a certain something from me when he was leaving. Wait, is this where he was stashing his weapon? And what would that be? A large trunk. I wouldn't be able to tell you what's inside it. Randy entrusted it to me two years ago when he first came to Crossville. <laughs> he kept it here, wow. He told me to destroy it and throw it away at the scrapyard if he ever died. My word. Mayhaps. <laughs> Randy, that does not seem like him at all. God damn it. God damn it! Sometimes I wish I didn't have earbuds and I just had, like, speakers. Ugh, that's annoying. I know a bit about his history. However, I don't know everything. You may be the only ones who can help him. Drake. We know. We will. Wireless ones? What I... Yeah, but I'm, I'm concerned about the delay that you could have. Especially across Bluetooth. These are nice-ass pair of Sony ones. I see. Alright, we know. We will. Bum, 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 bum. Oh. We have a good idea of Rainy's movements between last night and this morning. Quest turned in, good to go. No clue. <clears throat> Alright, we have a good idea of Rainy's movements between last night and this morning. Yeah, let's try piecing it all together. Oh, where did Randy go first? It didn't even pop- Oh, the question's right there. Third choice. Barca Casino. Where did Randy go next? Nian Volley. May I, I don't know which one of these. Second choice. Guillaume. Where did he go last? I wonder. Yeah, that has to be it. There's no mistaking it. The fuck? What does this mean? Three, five, six? Oh. Oh! <laughs> Never mind. It says three to four a.m. Get the weapon, maintenance on the weapon, ammo, and other supplementary items. Yep. Tis true. Makes sense. He began by seeing Drake to pick up the trunk he left with. As for what was inside, it was the weapon Rainy used while he was still Jaeger. It's likely a type of high power orbital rifle. Alright, so. So my, my hopes, my hopes for this are we get, we go save Randy from doing whatever he's doing. We have our sappy moment to take him back. And now that he's back, instead of using his orbital halberd, he now has a badass new weapon instead. That would be sick. I'm sure they'll be able to completely resolve this. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Listen, I just want Randy back, and I want him to have a new shiny weapon. That's, that's my goal, my want. Oh, Anixi, you spoiled it. It's just an S-Craft. Oh, that makes so much sense, and it's disappointing. God damn it. <laughs> now I'm sad. 
And I mean, it's obvious that's what it's gonna be now, though. <sighs> All right, let's keep going. <clears throat> Bear in mind that orbital rifles are typically disassembled when transported or stored away. Randy likely took it to the repair factory to be serviced because it had not been used in over two years. That was my thinking, too. Having a well-maintenance weapon is a matter of life and death on the battlefield. Alright, we're, go we're going back into delayed chat reading mode. God damn it. Or delayed for me, anyway, you know. Randy wouldn't go anywhere without having it checked first. Finally, he stopped by Nian Valley to stock up on supplies. He bought gunpowder ammo, gunpowder ammo, too, apparently. That's no ordinary rifle. I've heard the Reinford Company does make models that can change between orbital power and gunpowder ammunition. Hmm. Whether or not it's one of those, I think it's safe to say it's likely a modified weapon. It wouldn't surprise me. Red Constellation uses large rifles like... Rifles, the likes of which I've never seen before. Anyway, that sums up what Randy has been doing the last several hours. Randy left the exchange shop sometime after 6 a.m. It is about 10 a.m. now, so we are four hours behind him. Which means it's going to be difficult to find his tail now. Not necessarily. Randy's tough, but even ha he has his limits. He's really going into battle with the Red Constellation. He'll be sure to be well rested beforehand. That's and we can count on him trying to use the terrain to his advantage. He knows he'll only have one shot. Assuming it's not a suicide mission, of course. Reinford. Mm -hmm. Regardless, we don't have much time. Yeah, we have no choice but to book it to mains on the dub. Phone call. It couldn't be. Is it Randy? SSS, Lloyd Banning speaking. Man's voice. Is it... Is it Rando Orlando? Hello, this is Dominant. Shut up. Hello, Lloyd. <laughs> uh, could you have perhaps been expecting someone else? Who would this be? No, this is Patrick. Is this the Krusty Krab? No, this is Patrick! The, this voice. How do you have this number? Please, haven't I told you what a big fan I am of the SSS? I don't know who the fuck this is. I wish they would just tell me so I, I can voice act it right. Poorly. <laughs> Times Department Store. If you have the time, please come to the roof. Lloyd, was that not... H who was it? Ah. But it's funny when you get the like, voice completely wrong. That's why I just go with my standard voice when I don't know anymore. It's what I've done. Cow from Hayway. Ah. So he's waiting for us on the roof of the department store in Central Square. What? At a time like this, what is he planning? I'm not sure. All I know is that he of all people wouldn't reach out to us without good reason. I say we stop by there before going to the mountain path. Uh, understood. We should hurry. Make sure everything. Oh, there's Kia! Please find Randy and bring him home, everyone. We will, Kia. Don't you worry about that. Randy's so cruel, though. How dare you make poor Kia worry so much? Just have to give him the scolding of a lifetime when we find him. You'd better. Mysteries on top of mysteries. There's nothing to report right now. Mr. Reese, Mr. Reese, Times Department Roof. Excuse me. Hold. Save the game.
Is this the same chapter that had the terrorist attack in it? Or was that last chapter? I don't know. <laughs> I'm glad you didn't delay. Didn't bring protection with you this time, Cow? That's right. Aren't you usually with that one bodyguard, Lao, I believe is his name? We've been terribly busy, so I have him running errands for me. Besides, those blood-drunk fiends aren't in the city at the moment, are they? That means I can walk underneath the blue sky's splendor without a care in the world. I like Cow. I mean, I, he's very, like, conniving and probably evil. But I like his character. You are as dubious as ever. When I think of Heiwei's youngest and sharpest manager, I don't think sunshine and rainbows, that's for sure. <laughs> Perhaps you're correct. Neither of us have time to spare, so allow me to cut straight to the chase. And the truth of the matter is, I received a message from Master Yin last night. If someone's supposed to be evil, Cow gives us helpful info a ton. Well, I mean, I think he's doing it for his own benefit in the end. Or that's how I perceive it, anyway. I mean, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> but, like, let's be real. Define evil. Ah! That's true it is well, Anxie. Because Yin's no better than Don Marsoni. Kills people. And he could have had us killed a long time ago. Yes, this this is very true. Very true. Yeah, I get you. I guess, alright. We can't define evil. He's just someone that's looking out. He's not looking out for our interest at all. You know. Weissman, Joachim are evil? Well, yeah. I mean, those have been, like, the... I would say... The Red Constellations... Ah, I mean, I guess we can't even really say evil, but bad people. If you have a disregard for life in general, you're probably not a good person. But I think Rishia, while being an assassin, still regards... some life precious. So not completely evil. And Saivo makes, you know, the most valid point out of everyone here. But, yeah. <laughs> Alright, the truth of the matter is, I received a message from Zayn last night. Stating that our long-term contract is being terminated. Ooh, that's bad for them, I think. That, I mean, the, Heiwei has been using Yin for a, while, a long time, I imagine. I mean, hence long-term, God damn it, T, come out of your hole! Don't you want to come out of your hole? It, it's just not coming. There we go. I give up. It won't come out. You too good for your hole? Don't you want to go home? <laughs> Alright, say hello to Connor is being turned. Hartman was indeed a Paradise customer, which is fucked up. Every, anyone involved with Paradise is definitely evil. That is a fact. Oh. Well. Oh dear. I was utterly shocked. I tried my hardest to have you reconsider, but alas, no such luck. How troubling indeed. Oh yeah. Oh yeah? Fuck you, T. It won't come out of the hole. What does any of this have to do with us? What exactly happened at the southern shore of Lake Elm yesterday? Are you asking because... He saw us go there, so he knows. So, you know we were there too. Ah. Which means we ran into Yin. Indeed. Also, I also know members of Ouroboros Embracers were present, too. Do tell me, what's happened to Master Yin? 
Well, you see... We're under no obligation to tell you anything. Does that mean that something did happen to her after all? Huh? Don't let him get to you, Ellie. One slip the tongue and... Wait. Well, well, aren't you a sly dog? Oh, he said her! He said her! <laughs> Interesting. It's as I suspected. Master Yin is indeed a woman. Hmm. May I presume that she is using... She used... Neigong, Neigong, to alter her key and physique. I don't know what Neigong, Neigong is, but whatever. Given her extreme physical prowess, her success on the stage comes as no surprise. What? He fucking knows. He's this dude's smart. Damn it. Hmm. I did have my suspicions, so I researched every Arc and Seal member's schedule. All right, he already fucking knew. Yeah, I mean. He's smart. Whenever Master Yen would refuse our request, it happened to coincide with days our conceal performed. <laughs> An age. My oh my, thanks to you, I finally had it confirmed. What do you plan to do with her? Uh, for the time being, absolutely nothing. Since I'm the only one within Heiwei that knows for the moment, I thought I could perhaps blackmail her. Unfortunately, the Bracer Guild being involved makes it too hard to have all you silenced right here and now. Evil! He is evil! <laughs> huh? Now isn't the time for tasteless jokes, you know. If that's all you had to say, you'll have to excuse us. We're busy. Oh, it's just a joke. It's just a prank, bro. I was just kidding about killing you. Oh, you don't have to be like that. I'll offer you some good news as a reward for the valuable information you've given. You're looking for Randy, yes? Leave you aside somewhere along the Mains Mountain Path three hours ago. Well, no shit, we know he's going there. Huh! Really? We're shocked? Why are we shocked about this? R really? We have specialized units for the purpose of monitoring the Red Constellation's movements. I received the intel from them. What did you expect? I know. How convenient. You can can you be more specific? He was seen south of the waterfall where the CGF has its defenses posted. He scaled down a raised area with a rope. Oh. My men gave up on their observations out of fear but of being noticed after that. Lloyd! I'll hand it to you. That's exactly- I'll hand it to you. That's exactly the kind of info we needed. Thank you, Cal. You have my gratitude. Your success only benefits us in the end. See to it that you don't fall in battle alongside Randy. Your opponent's strength is... immeasurable. Yeah, we know. Alright, let's get a hold of the Chief's Enigma. Let's get a hold of the Chief's Enigma. Oh, okay. We're calling him. And then head for the Mains Mountain Path. Okay. Roger. There's still time. We ha we have to catch up to him. A bunch of text with their IQs lower than the frame rate in the new Pokemon. Oof. That's a big oof. I must say, I do enjoy watching naive yet passionate exploits. Well then. Give us a monologue, cow. We have a critical situation on our hands. I believe we must use all of the tools at our disposal if we're to survive. Oh, not a monologue, just a sentence. Alright, one second. Ah! I swear I have a nose hair that's like making my nose itch constantly. It's fucking annoying. Alright. So... <clears throat> Main's Mountain Path. Aye aye, Captain. Let's rest in our car. save the game and let's go fuck up some terrorists well not even terrorists just 
Jaegers. What's the difference? One of them's paid. There's the ridge before the waterfall. It is just as Cow's Intel described it. Let's move. Randy repelled down the area's cliffside. We need to hurry up. Oh. Well, my bad. Okay. End of chapter boss. 70 turn. 70 turn? I beat things in like 10. We fine. I hope. <laughs> Alright, let's go, friends. This must be the rope he used to climb down. There's no telling what could be down this way, though. You're right. There should be a rocky ravine that way, but it looks like it goes down forever. I know, but this is the only way we're going to catch up to him. Boss has 7 mil HP. We are fucked. We are fucked. It's the only way we're going to catch up to him. Descend the rope. Alright, is everyone ready? Noelle, you stay behind. You're useless. Preparations complete. All set. Ditto. Let's get moving. Randy's waiting for us. Best courts in the game coming up. Oi. Oh, master courts. You gotta say master courts, Anix. You fool. Right, everyone watch your footing as you climb down. This is a familiar song. Wait, deserted mine? Wait a second. Oh, throw it on a support bitch? Okay, we can do that. Where are we? It looks like a shaft that's connected to a very old tunnel. This may connect to the deserted mine that was sealed during the incident in August. Yeah, I think that's geo- I think that geographically lines up. If this path leads up into the deserted mine, that could give him opportunity to merge behind the Jaeger's defense line. Damn, sneaky. That would make, make this the ideal path for him to take if he was looking to take them by surprise. When they know about this path, then they like block off the mine with explosives that one time and... Nah, maybe not. I sense that Randy has already passed through here. Luckily, the tunnel ahead is not too complex. We should be able to proceed without getting lost. Good to know. Alright team, let's catch up to Randy. Yes. Roger. Al what the fuck? Alons E. I don't know that word. Alright, no map. Unlucky. Oh, it's a straight path. Okay. It's a big one. <laughs> Chansta. Man, I need to scan you assholes or I would totally do that. Mm, Battle scope. Damn it! Analyze. <laughs> Art. What are you weak to? We don't know. When in doubt, soul blur out. Ah, wind. Very dark. Burst orb. Huzzah. The crits. 
Level ups. Black boots. Forget horrible guns. Chests have everything you could need. Lock, stock, and barrel. I don't know if I looked at the other chest. Oh, it was a bullshit one. Okay. I don't like this being so damn dark. It's annoying. <laughs> oh, next screen, I guess. Oh yeah, we got those boots. I need to see if they're any good. Oh, black booties. Wait, was it ebony boots? I guess it Wait, no. It was black boots, but they're doo-doo. Damn, that's a lot more defense, though. I don't know about it, though, man. I don't know. It's tough. 60 defense is a lot. But you don't need defense when you dodge everything. Why the fuck is Noel? Oh, we left her behind. That's why she's a low level. Ah. I was like, why is this bitch so low? God damn it, Ellie. Auto attack. Bunch of sepith. Took years to perfect my bellberry juice cocktail recipe. Always knew I could get over the barrier. Ah, <laughs> uh, monster chest? Ah, uh, double. <laughs> Damn, they fucking up Ellie. Okay, assholes. Oh. Yo, they they fucking hate Ellie. Let's save before doing this. Alright, let's see how cancer this chest is. Oh monsters up here. That's a big boy. Oh four big boys. Uh, if we got a crit, might as well smack it. <laughs> Death spiral. <laughs> Yelma. Oh, great. Sprays poisonous shit. Get countered, idiot. Quit hitting Ellie, you assholes! Why? Did they just hate Ellie? Did that just say 11k? Surely not. Maybe it was only. Oh, they are double weak to it. Yep, that's 11k. Jesus, fuck, girl. <coughs> Why 
Why does Sparkdyne hit so fucking hard? That's crazy. Detection Quartz. Help us! Our tunnel has been occupied by the Red Constellation, the strongest Jaegercore in all of Chester and Zemiria. Oh, Red Chestellation. God damn. What does Detection do again? Displays treasure chest locations on the minimap. <laughs> uh, I mean, we could throw that on uh, her just for the hell of it, you know? There you go. Four Mirage, two Space. Nah, that's not that good. That's useless, dude. All we need is Spark Dine and Crimson Ray. That's because you can't get the 21 point higher elemental spells yet. <laughs> Kabaroom! Yeah, they also cost 400 EP! <laughs> that thing better one shot bosses to cost that much. This is fucking dumb. Oh shit, it ran into me. Sparka Dainu. Countered idiot. Yeah, but food, food's too good. Food's too good. I can't. I can't use food. That's cheating. Buying meld items is cheating? Nah, nah, dude, that, that's just resources. Cast two. God damn it, the stupid ch trails in the chest is worthless. <laughs> fuck is this thing? Is it turtles? Oh fuck. They are murder turtles. That is our first cast, too, but I'm afraid to lose my spells I got. Man, they tanky boys. You lived? Fuck off. Not the murder turtles. God damn it, the chain. Fuck, they strong. What are they weak to? What does it say? Water? Probably should use fire still because it gives her another cast. Oh, right here. No, they get a team attack! Cheaters! Oh. Fuck you things in your ricochet! I will, I will murder you all. Let's see? Yeah, good art guard, idiot. Sparkdyne even faster? That would be busted, but I don't know if I. I might lose Sparkdyne. Uh, I mean, I probably don't need all the water. Probably don't need all the water. Yeah, we're good. Yeah, that wasn't giving us much. I think I was using it for the Mirage thing, but I ended up not ever needing Mirage. So that's fine. Celestial Bomb EX. Story of my life. I was placed here. I had that item put in me. You opened me, and then the chest is history. Chest is history.
Can Tio get Spark Dine? No. It's impossible. Has Crimson been hitting? Nah, she never fucking gets to use it because it takes 10 years to go off, honestly. But I'm too- it's too late to turn back this time. Plus, I don't know. I would lose a lot of shit trying to go for it. Spark Dainu. Spark Dainu, 11k, baby. Okay, there should be a... Oh, Another one! I'd make sure you see peep food or arts food. Nah, dude, that's cheating. I ain't no cheater. Spark dime. Damn it, you, you can't use it till after? What's the point? Boy, get in there deep. There you go. You too. Oh. Why didn't you guys go for Lloyd, you assholes? I hate this Now we only spark diet. Spark diner. Tio, you suck! Whatever, we'll just keep using baby spells. It's fine. Boom! Shoot it. Smack it. Well, those things are, like, max effective against wind. Mobius! What is this, fucking Xenoblade 3? And upon closer inspection, you see a chessboard in the chest. You move the white rook to E4. Chest mate. Busted a corpse. Get rid of shield, dude. Level it up. What does it do? It's already level 3. The stats are terrible! Increased potency of healing items. Oh, this is some bullshit item bullshit. This is why you think it's busted. I ain't cooking. Cooking's for bitches. AoE, oh wait, no. AoE items. That sounds pretty good though. I can, I can appreciate AoE items. Yeah, sure it'll, surely it'll give us a healing spot before a boss fight. We have arts reflect food and guard food. I personally don't have any food. <laughs> Tio, your range is terrible. <laughs> uh, Mobius, there should be one more chest. There it is. Fucking turtles. Uh, just, just do something to you. I don't care what it is. Just hit him with water. Seventy-five percent effective. Fuck it. Oh, almost got it. Chitness shell. Tear all bomb. Fucking trails in the chest bullshit. Are we out? Have we made it to the mines of Moria? God damn it, we're gonna get attacked by some bullshit, aren't we? God damn it.
Uh huh. From above? Why is there always some robot jaguar thing? Look out. They're like the ones we saw before. It's a pincer attack. Here they come. Oh. Nice and this idiot. Ah, oh, hit me. Alright, scope it out. Blade cougar. Oh, they're cougars. Where's Randy? He he likes a nice cougar. Death blow? Nah, dude. We we just we die, we die. You know. We die, we die. Spark dinner. Uh, please don't hit us with the death blow. Run away. Oh fuck it. Fuck it. If it happens, it happens. Where are they weak to? Whatever. If it happens, it happens. Alright, we're fine. Mm, yeah, sit down there. Wrecked him. Someone needs mana? No, it's too damn bad. <clears throat> what was with them? They were crazy strong. They remind me of Warhounds. Imagine if the chapter ends and you miss DP. I would just keep going. It doesn't mean that much to me. I mean, I would be very sad, obviously, because there's no going back. Except they weren't canines, they were felines. Could they have belonged to the Red Constellation? Possibly. Jaeger Corps are known for using military monsters. Yeah, but Ravash's old warhounds don't hold a candle to how ferocious they were. Yes, and they seem more coordinated, too. I do not believe that pincer attack was a coincidence. That sleazy Minith character also used them. Does that mean he has a connection with the Red Constellation, too? That's a good point. We could have been working with them to funnel government secrets or raise funds. He could have. Regardless, let's counter Lucky Stars if we were able to defeat them. The X is likely just ahead. Let's go. Right. Ba 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 ba. EP charge. Get the EP back, Ellie. I swear, if there's a thing though that gives me EP before I have to fight a boss, like there always is. There's a boss, we, we all F4 and give her mana. Oh, what's this? What's up, Enadan? This is it, we're near the entrance to the, to the deserted mine. Thank goodness, I'm glad we got here in one piece. We still haven't found Randy. Where is he? If the fighting hasn't started yet, we still have time to catch up to him. Oh, that might be it. Sounds like a fucking Final Fantasy song. That sound, it came from near the exit. I can also hear a firefight in the distance. You're right, Saibo. He did, didn't he? Randy! We have to go. Yes, sir. Will we make it in time? Go, go, go! Save the game, though. Is a station. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. Now we save. 
I wish it told you like uh, what the good ones were, what they did, you know. Uh, you have to make them first, clown. Yeah, not necessarily. HP slash CP plus twenty. Oh. Omelette rice. Burger. Bitter burger wasn't bad. Make omelette rice. Wait, do I not have things for it? I can only make four! Go, Lloyd. That was shit! See, I don't have the good recipes, dude, and these all suck. Yep, they all suck. Alright, let's keep on keeping on. Let me make sure... 70 turns, right? 70... 70 turn news. Ah, huh? What? Yo, wait, is Randy just storming this fucking entire group of Jaegers by himself? Man's a ma- he's a madman, if so. What? No way, Captain Randolph! Disperse, don't stand in one spot! Oh shit, there he goes, with his Lancer from Gears of War. Oh shit, the shadow over the eyes. What? Captain hasn't lost his edge! Hey, send in the cougars! Oh shit, oh shit, go Randy. <laughs> nice try, boys. Oh, there's the new S-Craft. <laughs> Just found out that Reverie will have VR support? Eh, no thanks. No thanks. How does that even work? VR support for what, you asked The fans? <laughs> ah. Oh, shit. The, the Red Reaper. Don't falter. Attack him in waves. Are we trading tonight? I didn't see that, but maybe. I don't know when I'm going to end. You're kidding me. It, he's overwhelming them. I cannot believe what I am seeing. This is the combat prowess Rainy has been suppressing? Sheesh, because he didn't need our help after all. Yeah, until Shirley gets in there. Or not, things just got a little more dangerous. What? Oh, and there she is. <laughs> You're looking pretty good, Dolphy. Shirley? Oh, shit. I knew you still had it in you. You're still not my type, but I have to admit you're pretty cool just now. You're cousins! <laughs> right? At least not brother and sister, I guess. I didn't ask for your goddamn opinion. It makes you think I'd want to be involved with a man-eater like you. Since when has Japanese media cared? Never. They put Agate and Tita as a as a thing. <laughs> you you wound me. But hey, since we're already here, let me have a little bit of fun. <laughs> the weapon's bigger than him by a large margin. Damn. Yeah, I thought so. You're still pretty dull. Not going all out in us in so long. This is your limit, ain't it? Did you fully master Testarossa? I'm not the same little kitten when you were teaching me, Dolphy. 
You seriously hadn't figured that out yet? Uh-oh. She's got the lantern. <laughs> Let's go! Wait, it got broken? Uh, is that the best you got, Dolphy? I was barely getting warmed up. Well, whatever. I already found myself a better playmate anyway. The fuck's that? S screw you. If you ask me, you should just give up and let Daddy get you back in fighting shape. Once you get some of that battle experience back, you'll be able to really... You'll finally be ready to become the new war god. But I can always take an arm and a leg for good measure first. Good. Randy! What's the big idea? Uh-huh. Go squad! Get in there! <laughs> Not bad. This might be a fun change of pace after. Oh shit! Lloyd went in there, man! <laughs> Lloyd! Yo, fucking no fear. <laughs> this is how Lloyd is. <laughs> You're a lot more decisive than you look, detective boy. Didn't anyone teach you that a gentleman doesn't force himself on a lady? One glance is all I need to know that I can't hold back on you. I've accepted S rank 1 in monster requests less dangerous than you. <laughs> boy has massive balls. <laughs> this is the truth, man. God damn, I don't know how he carries those things, dude. <laughs> you got that right, sugar. Uh-oh. No, get away from her! There's no way those Tonfas are going to hold up! Well, obviously. What? Was he? Oh! Well, hello! That was close. Great, even an underhanded attack like that wasn't enough to trip her up. Commander! Young Miss! Oh shit, this is our fight, isn't it? Fuck! All of you. Oh, shit. <laughs> okay, okay. If you want to play that badly, I don't mind humoring you for a little bit. Jesus. <laughs> yeah, you better show me a good time. Here she comes. Don't hold back. Fight like your lives depend on it. This is hype. <laughs> oh, baby. Uh, maybe we should, uh... I either want to put Lloyd straight in there, I'm not sure. I might just, like, do this. Yeah, he's got a lot of, uh... Oh, he can suck them all in. And then we could just, like, do... Oh, I do have to scan. God damn it. Thanks for mentioning. Alright, at least both of those are the same. <sighs> I hate scanning. Such bullshit. At least we can analyze one of them with Tio. You're not in range! Fuck. Oh my god, they're both not in range. Uh oh. Oh, thank god. This is AoE? No. I know there's burst, but I'm trying to hold it for if they cast. And I want to get these scans off. I don't have to scan that. Alright, so I just gotta get Shirley. Then we can use burst. It's fine. I know it wears off. I played the game one, like for a little bit, actually. Believe it or not. Believe it or not. I mean... Honestly, her cast is probably going to be better here than... Let's see how much this is. She has 22k. Oh yeah, I know. I know, I know. Big C. This is going to be hype. Crimson Ray. Ah, uh, it's not... Oh, well, it doesn't matter. We don't need buffs. We strong as fuck. Watch. 7k is pretty good. Alright, let's just combo with Lloyd. 
I've actually never seen this one. Oh wait, yeah, yeah. I think I used it once on my own. I think. We so strong. Is Spark Dime better than Thunder Cyclone? Or will Thunder Cyclone do more? It is better? That's sad. Need to do everyone's Lloyd commas three times? Even Noel and Wazzy? Damn. This was <laughs> This is already over. This is a joke. This song's hype though, goddamn. How can you not beat this in 70 turns? Like I don't know if that even took 10. <laughs> I, I, I really don't know. <laughs> Oh man, that was fun. That was hot. that was, song was good as fuck too. This hype for the moment. <sighs> <sighs> so this is what it's like to fight an elite Jaeger. I can't let her win just because she has more experience. No, well, you don't get the say in this really. You meant to say seven turns? I mean, we fuck. We might have still got it there. I don't know. <laughs> Alright, we can't let her win just because she has more experience. I'll hand it to you guys. I'm impressed, but just a little. That was a decent appetizer before the main course. Uh-huh. Ah. Uh. Oh, CGF's here. Mm-hmm. There's a reason I play normal, because I like steamrolling fights. <laughs> Second Lieutenant Muriel. Oh, there's the girl. Was she looking at the camera right now? God damn. You followed after us. Yes, the commander received a call from your chief. The enemy forces in our sights commence the sweep operation. Prioritize recapturing mains and the safety of civilians above all else. Yes, ma'am! We killed like half their friends. Oh, I would be. If I was a part of the CGF, half my friends got killed, I would be coming in here blasting the fuck out of these people and not caring. But, you know, that's me. Good old revenge, you know? <laughs> Except... So I started blasting. Wait until Sigmund shows- Yeah, I was gonna say, like, if Sigmund shows up, I think we're in a lot of fucking trouble. <laughs> See, the issue there is you'd be a part of the CGF. Oh, yeah, that's true. I wouldn't be that. Fuck that. Alright. And we have seen they haven't done shit in years of knowing. True. True. Mm -hmm. Well, I'll catch you guys later. But don't worry. I have a feeling we'll meet each other again soon. I like her weapon. It's badass. Got about another half hour? Sick. I'm all for it. Oh, here it is. Muriel. Give, give him a good slap, Muriel. I swear. Take my eyes off you for a second and you pull something like this. Ah. Constant reader! Happy Friendsgiving. Happy, happy. Thank you for the sub, brother. I was hoping she would just, like, come up teary-eyed and slap him. You know, classic. The classic. <clears throat> Let us handle it from here. I'd appreciate it if the rest of you could make sure Randy doesn't do anything this stupid again. Loud and clear. Neo Matter! Yo, Neo, what's up, man? How's it going? Thank you, thank you for the raid. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. How was the stream tonight? How was, I assume, Trails from Zero? How was Trails? Peak Trails? How are you? But oh, I'm doing well. I know we're a little quiet right now because the <laughs> the time of the raid here. 
Going back into the finale. Oh, I'm going to have to watch the VOD. I'm excited to see you while well, I experience it again, right? <laughs> awesome, awesome. Hey, guys. Guys, from my stream, if you don't know Neomatter, please check him out. Check out his channel. He's one of my favorite channel uh, <clears throat> streamers to watch when I'm not streaming. <clears throat> but, yeah. So, if you just joined, I'm Zach. I'm a big fan of Trails. Recently just got into the series this year, thanks to Neo hyping it up all the time. <laughs> and yeah, I just like to play a lot of JRPGs other than that, but we'll be playing some trails for a long time until we're caught up. So yeah, we're, we're in the thick of it right now and I'm really excited to see what's going to happen. Randy was making some dumb decisions here and we had to go and save him. But yeah, let's uh, get back into it. Thanks again for the Neo, or <laughs> for the street raid, Neo. Fumbling on my words, I apologize. <clears throat> we will be sure of it. Ugh, <sighs> that's finally over. What a way for him to get back into the mix. Yo, <laughs> yeah. Yo, this, uh, that fight with Shirley was hype. F the music, mm, mm. All right, <sighs> that's finally over. We can finally take a moment to breathe. Ooh, the shadow over the eyes still. Yeah, chef's kiss, exactly, exactly. R Randy? Is everything all right? You didn't get hurt or anything, did you? Lloyd, answer me one question. What the hell were you thinking? Uh, huh? Yo, he's just trying to save his friend. Oh, fuck. <clears throat> huh? Randy? Randy, why? Oh, the song too? Don't you get it? You just stepped onto the battlefield. You're not a Jaeger, not a soldier. You never spilled anyone's blood. Yet you waltzed right in here. Can't you see just how goddamn dangerous that was? Oh, it's so good, man. So good. Randy. I don't think this excludes you, Mademoiselle Teotot. Noel and Wazi, too. You two understand the dangers better than they do. I have no idea why you didn't stop them. But you, Lloyd, where the hell do you get off calling yourself a leader after pulling this shit? Bruh, you you made us do this! What? I mean I get I get his side, but come on. What the hell were you thinking? Putting your team's lives on the line at a time like this. Anadon, you should get timed out for that. These games are amazing in every way. Don't screw with me. Yo, get him, Lloyd. Hell yeah! Huh? Lloyd! Lloyd, what are you... Trying to save my teammate's life was why I came here! See ya? Really? Did you seriously think that little scrap of paper was gonna justify you leaving our lives forever? No. Aw, oh, shit. I always knew. Someone like me never should have become close to you guys in the first place. Come on, Randy. Hands are drenched in blood. Their lives have taken away. They weren't all soldiers. Didn't think twice about using an innocent village to trap our enemies. I killed him. A regular guy with eyes just like yours. Uh That's who's standing in front of you. An irredeemable piece of shit. Fuck, man. Get it now? I don't belong here. You keep looking at me with puppy dog eyes like I'm some dependable big brother. If you keep it up, I... I feel like I might forgive myself for everything I've done! Fuck, man. <laughs> oh, Randy. Please, Randy. I'm so sorry. 
So that's what it is. <laughs> Dude, I love Brandy, man. <laughs> Fucking Lloyd. Man, that's a relief. Uh huh. L Lloyd? Lloyd, what do you. I wasn't sure what I was gonna do if we came up here and all you did was try to crack jokes like usual. But finally. You finally came clean to us. Huh? Ah. Lloyd. The truth is, we're not different. At the heart of it, you're just as young as we are. All of us knew you had a heavy burden. But we thought not touching on it was the respectful thing to do. We simply kept relying on you without ever returning the favor. That is true. He's right. C come on. I just said that I don't deserve that kind of treatment. She do, Randy. Come on, man. That's where you're wrong. Your past actions and sense of guilt are yours to carry. And that's something that falls on you to come to terms with. You have to res you have the resolve, Randy. Of course, the terms you reach may still not allow you to forgive yourself. But even if no one else will forgive you, even if you won't forgive yourself, I promise we will forgive you, Randy. Oh my god, Lloyd is so good. He's... <sighs> Legitimately just like the best fucking leader you could ask for, right? Ah. <sighs> writing is ever yeah the trail is writing man it's so good it's so good and that's right being able to forgive and accept each other is exactly what makes us a team the same as when you all accepted me even after learning of my past it is only right that I forgive your transgressions just as I do your sleazy, <laughs> sleazy careless attitude <laughs> Marching the gun. If Lloyd was te was leading, I would too, man. I love Lloyd as leader. He's just the best dude. <laughs> Good old Tio. I forgive you too, of course. What it means to take lives on the battlefield is something we, as soldiers, have always had to face. Well, far be it from me to give a heartfelt speech about friendship. <laughs> But the truth is, that everyone piles up sin simply by living. That is to say, in the eyes of Ideos, we're not all that different, are we? Oh, Randy. None of us can live in the past or see the future. All we can do is live in the moment, like every single day is our last. And in this very moment, we stand together in the same place and time. If that simple fact makes you even a little happy, I'm asking that you accept us for who we are and our forgiveness. <laughs> Sheesh. Every damn time. What did I do to deserve this kind of goddamn compassion? This ain't some kind of sappy novel. No need to hold it in. I know exactly what it is like to be in your position. <laughs> That's right, as I recall. That night you said something to the effect of us all falling prey to Lloyd's cheesiness when we joined the SSS. Wait, why is it my fault again? <laughs> hmm? He does have a way with words, doesn't he? <laughs> all the experience I've gained as a host and still don't compare it to a smooth talker like him. <laughs> Come on, Randy. <sighs> I'm a murderer. A useless, good-for-nothing jackass. I tried to act all tough and smart, but in the end, I got my ass kicked by a monstrous little girl. Hell, it's amazing my temper hasn't gotten us killed yet. 
but it might someday. Ooh, it's a new one, I think. And despite all that, you still don't mind? <laughs> Not one bit. Hell yeah, Randy. Welcome back, buddy. Of course we don't. Bring it on. <laughs> Let's go. I'll always be there to pick up the slack. You know what they say, adversity builds character. <laughs> Screw you, Wazzy. What the hell was happened to keeping your mouth shut? You ended up ratting me out, didn't you? <laughs> Wazzy didn't say a thing, man. Cut me some slack here. <laughs> I didn't breathe a word. It was Lloyd and the others that decided to look for you and did the legwork to find you on their own. But wait a second, Wazzy. You knew Randy had left all along? <laughs> Wazzy, are you kidding me? Wazzy? <sighs> I wish I could say I was surprised. Hey, it's not like I knew exactly where he was headed. <laughs> He's in the doghouse? Yeah, he is. Come on, why do I have to be the bad guy? Because it's, it's you, Wazzy. Why are you like this? I say we leave him in the mountains to reflect on what he did. <laughs> Tio's just always ruthless. <laughs> With that off my chest, I'm ready to get back into business as usual. It's getting kind of late. Let's go see how Muriel and the others are doing. Yeah, I agree. I can only hope the Red Constellation made a full retreat from the mountain path. Oh, what a, what a great moment, man. Oh, I love this freaking game. It's too good. Can't wait till March to play this again. I might even have to. <laughs> be just a few months away. Nah, we'll see. I'll probably be on Cold Steel. Who knows how far. The Red Constellation has fully retreated from the mountain path. Played it once with the Geofront team. Have you played CS yet? I have not played any Cold Steel games yet. So, yeah, it'll be all brand new to me. You'll be on Curl, you'll learn Japanese just to play it. <laughs> I'm tempted to, man. Yeah, <laughs> that'll take me a bit for sure. But I'm glad. I'm hoping it holds me over until uh, Reverie comes out. So that's, that's the plan, anyway. Alright, the Red Custler's fully retreated from the mountain path. Thankfully, looting was kept to a minimum. And that's a relief. Thank goodness, that's one silver lining. It's core policy to not to, uh, not to loot the, uh, civilians unless necessary. Damn, all it took for Red Constellation to bail was a few CGF members and Randy? <laughs> You're not wrong. These are incredible games, the best series ever made. It's, yeah, for sure. I mean, after playing the Sky Trilogy, I was like, all in. And then Crossbell just like, kicked it up another notch. It's been so good. <sighs> Alright, but if they had been ordered to, they would have stripped the place of everything that wasn't nailed down. So why were they here? Like, what, what was the point of all this? Randy? Are you alright? I heard that you got a little carried away back there. <clears throat> you know when you ask que I know, Anixi. My questions always get answered within the next, like, ten minutes. <laughs> well, not always. Sometimes my questions last the entire fucking series. <laughs> you love watching gamers react, react and enjoy them too? Yeah, I do too. Ever since I played them, I watch- That's like all I watch a lot of the times now is other people playing Trails. It's a problem. <laughs> ah, I'm good. The rifle's gonna be out of commission for a while, though. Sucks after I went through all that trouble to have it fixed up. It's a good problem, though? <laughs> yeah, true. True, true. Uh, sucks after I went through all the trouble to fix up. Yep. Yeah. That chainsaw took a decent chunk of your rifle, didn't it? Speaking of Shirley's chainsaw rifle... 
go get snacks. Get snacks? What? what? Tea snacks? Why? Is, we don't have that much time left in this chapter, do we? Speaking of Shirley's chainsaw rifle, the Red Constellation has very unusual weapons, do they not? Yeah, that's the kind of stuff that you can only get done at, spe at a special workshop. Giyami should be able to figure something out if I ask, though. Yeah, I'm sure he can. When we get back to the city, let's drop it off with him first thing. I'm happy for you. You're finally able to pick up a rifle again. <laughs> Better late than never. And what's this I'm hearing? Were you worried about me? Uh, of course I was. If you had just been able to use a rifle back then, we could still be in the CGF together. I don't know if you guys are pulling my leg. You're saying there's another day, but I don't know. Not, not that I want us to be together or anything. <laughs> oh, Muriel. Just want you guys just get a room and, you know. I just wasn't sure a flaky guy like him could work any, anywhere else. <laughs> she has her charms. <laughs> just get married already? That's what I'm saying, dude. Come on. I think Randy has taken notice, too. Tie Randy down and make him respectable. <laughs> yeah, for real. Ahem. Yes, this is Muriel of the first unit. Good work. Where are they now? Huh? Could you repeat that? Uh, is everything alright? Uh oh, music change. The Jaegers who are retreating have vanished entirely. Again? Signs indicate that they fled towards the ruins at the fork in the tunnel. The ruins at the fork? Wait, like the, uh... There's a tower, right? Which one? Ah, th thank you, Tio. Thank you for answering. <laughs> the Moon Temple. Are you saying they took refuge inside the ruins? Unfortunately not. There are no signs of tampering with the barricade placed in front of the ruins. Where in the world did they... Oh, no. Did they get, like teleported I, I mean i don't know i'm just throwing shit out but like teleported somewhere some other like dimension type deal thing going on that area is lined with cliffs if not the ruins where else could they have gone i know that shirley girl is anything but sensical but this isn't adding up oh oh or did they just get airships and fly out well i guess that's a possibility too i mean they could have air <clears throat> Something's off. Thinking about it, their numbers on the mountain path were nearly what I thought they'd be. What? A whole lot of them came to Crossbell, about a hundred or so. There were only around twenty here in Mainz. More importantly, Sigmund Orlando. He was missing. This is true. He's a bigger monster than Shirley, so where the hell is he? Hmm. Could he be... Huh? Everyone, look! What are we looking at? Wait... Is Crossbell on fire? What? what Wait... Oh fuck, dude. It can't be! Crossbell City! It's on fire! Oh, fuck! They literally got- Oh, no, that's- So it was- Maybe it was all just a distraction to fucking raise the city- Or whatever they did to the city. <laughs> you gotta play a small bit in the chapter for Yeah, we're gonna do the intro. We always do the intro to uh, the chapter, so- uh, what's our DP supposed to be at? Let's take a look. 259. Uh-oh. Seven? Uh, four? Hey, we did it. We did it. We're fine. Hell yeah, the distant flames save. 
the double save. All right, let's, uh, man, chapter three, holy shit, stuff just, this game just keeps ramping things up, man. Though the beginning of this chapter was a little slow, it just, towards this end here, man. What's up, Annexy? You got, need something? A Knight of Foxes. You're sorry. Mm, the city's fine. Oh, it's the... Hey, we get to see this. That's cool. Look at Sully. Oh, wait. I think that's Sully, right? Yeah. I love these performances they do. They're so good. Sully's amazing. She's killing it out there. That's right, her training paid off in spades. Y yeah, that's true. I guess she did alright. Or is it more like, I guess she did alright. <laughs> this theatrical edition truly re revolutionizes what was already a splendid performance. I agree. Ilya and the troop leader's persistence paid off. God damn, Risha. What's up? Yes. As long as Sully's here, then even if I leave the troop, even if I leave, the troop will still... Oh, don't leave, Risha. Uh-huh. Oh, no. What's wrong? Has something caught your eye? What am I sensing? There's five, no, ten. Why? Why now? It can't be! Well, what's that? Heads up! Oh, this is where she went. Oh, fucking hell. But why Ark and Seal? <laughs> oh, thank goodness. For a second there, I thought I wasn't going to make it in time for the big finale. I to cut a show short and deprive your waiting audience for its new scene. Of its new scene. Don't look at it this way. We're all gonna have a good time no matter what. And that's what really matters, right? It's a crazy bitch. <laughs> Geronimo! Oh my fucking god! They actually... What the fuck? It's just... Oh, fuck, she's dead. Th what the fuck? <laughs> you guys, you assholes, you're always... <laughs> uh, holy shit, man. Well... I can't say I fucking expected this at all. Wha- Wha- Ilya! Dude, in front of all these spectators too, dude. Ilya's trapped! No, 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 no! Ilya! Yo, this is fucked up, man. I'm actually like... My heart- Aw, oh, man. Risha! Ilya, no, this, this can't be Ilya! How could this happen? Uh, why? Ilya, are you alright? Speak to me! Is this, oh my god. The first thing she cares about is if Soli is okay. I'm sure she's fine. Yeah. Yeah, she's okay. Is Soli okay? Uh, I'm fine. Had you not risked yourself, you, you, you... I'm glad. 
Grisha. <laughs> the next act, you're the only one. Oh my gosh, my phone, sorry. Dude, all she, and she's still like full focus on the, the act and everything. Ilya, Ilya! Huh? <clears throat> Theo, we must carry her to safety at once. Understood. Did you look at that? Even in the throes of death, she just couldn't stop thinking about the stage. Oh, I fucking hate you now. I thought you were cool looking, but now I just fucking hate you. I hate her. <clears throat> Ilya Platier really is a treasure, isn't she? Oops. Maybe it's was now. Oh. I, f I fucking hate her. I can totally see how you fell for Arisha. Bloody Shirley. This music's so good though. A, a girl? <laughs> Who is she? Oh my, is she just blasting the audience? A, a gun? She's got a gun! I don't know if she's just scaring them. What? Because they're just shooting in the air. Save me, Idios! So this place is burning down. <laughs> you bastards! <laughs> There it is! That's the face I wanted to see! That invincible strength! Show me what the real Rishia Mao can do when she isn't wasting it all on keeping up disguises. Oh, I hope she... Why do you have her weapon? Ah, there you go. Yo, I... Rishia... Oh, you better fucking kill her. Here, I did you the favor picking it up from your place on the way over. So, no more wasting time. Our stage is set. Let's dance to our heart's content, Risha. Oh, fuck! I'll make you pay, Shirley Orlando! No! Please! Yo, the screen's red, too? Oh, and this song's so good. Chapter 4, Crossbell's Fate. It's not done. God dang. Oh, fuck. This is the start of chapter four? This is fu- I just- This is insane. But why the fuck are they doing this? All these fucking people, man. Oh no, Fran! Oh sh- Alright, well, Fran's not there, but- She's still probably not anywhere better. Uh, Inspector, we have to take cover underground too. Idiots, we can't do that until all the upper floors have been evacuated. It's too early to let your guard down. The shutter's strong, but it's not impervious. D don't say that. They don't that even when the CGF was trying to break in, didn't it? That's why I'm saying we should hurry and evacuate already. There's Fran. All personnel have evacuated to the underground block. Now it's our turn, let's hurry. Got it. Thank Idius, we're safe. Oh fuck, please no. Huh? Damn it, quick, go! 
a grenade? No! No, he... No fucking way they kill Fran too. No fucking way. But I mean, why didn't one of them like just kick it away or like... And there's Arius and Dudley. Damn, when did they make it back into the city? What route could they have come from? The most likely explanation is that they used an airship. That would exp yeah, that does make sense. That would explain how that unit had- The unit that vanished on the mountain path made their escape. That's impossible. If that were the case, the anti-aircraft radar would have been tripped. It would be impossible to fly in the state's air- In the state's airspace without the radar picking them up. Unless they- Damn it. Could they be using the same technology that the society was using during the Liberal incident? That would be stealth functionality. Yes, it's possible that their airship is equipped with it. Forget that for now. We don't have the time to be worrying about it. I'm perfectly aware of that. Yo, let's go, Arios. Fuck them up. Come on, doodles. <laughs> You know, these guys ain't shit to Arios. The fuck was that? Is that f oh, Wald? Why are you here too? <laughs> well, ain't this something? An offering to celebrate this new power and to keep getting stronger, eh? <laughs> I like it. That advice ain't too shabby. Yo, that scene was sick. With the moot. <laughs> Dude, everybody in Crossbell is just fucking dead. The, the hell is that? Oh, this is gonna be the Saber Vipers. Yo, the old apartment building. It's totally wrecked! What the hell is that monster? <laughs> Perfect timing, boys. No way you kill your own your old men. No. What? Wh ah! You're just the kind Yo, this is so fucked up, Wald. Just the kind of sacrifices I was looking for. My past and my weaknesses. The useless trash that I tried to protect. What the? No way. What? Huh? Bro. Fucking Dino. Guys. Guys, Koki. S stay with me! No, Dino. R run. Away. Go. <laughs> I was wondering where you were. Uh, uh, a monster! Perfect. I'll make you join them. Deep voice? That is far enough. Dang, that's a big one, all right. Oh, what is that? A demon? Kinds, begin exterminating the surrounding fires. Let's go, Abbas. Y yes sir Jingu, I need you to tell everyone in the neighbor to take refuge. On it, Mama. Well, well, if it isn't Baldy and that shady-ass weapons dealer. <laughs> You gonna show me what your real power looks like too? If that is what you desire. Is this guy gonna be a badass? Oh shit! Wazi has authorized me to go as far as necessary to put a stop to you. Good goddess. I really don't like having to whip out the good stuff. Remember going there to... To, to exterminate monsters, Wald. Yeah, Wald fucking destroyed it, dude. God damn. 
But I can't just let you wreck the neighborhood. I'm trying to run a business down here, you know? <laughs> she brings out a fucking rocket launcher. <laughs> Bring it on. Witness the might of Wald Whale. Bitch, you cheating. You ain't mighty. You succumb to this bullshit. I'll crush your bones until there's nothing left but marrow and dust. Yeah, this song's so good. No, I wanted to see how strong Abbas really was, man. This is fucking terrible, though, man. Alright, Heiwei. They're here. Hold the line, men. We cannot let them infiltrate the building. Yes, sir! Damn. Tch. Heiwei's martial artist, eh? They've got spirit. I'll give them, give them that. Oh, she boys are dead. It's not good. The Red Ogre! Fucking Sigmund. If you think you can stop us, then go right ahead. I'll give you one chance. I'll take you all on. What? Do not mock us! Wait. Don't. You fools. <laughs> Is that all? Jesus! Gah, impossible! Ugh. Okay, Lao. So, you're Cal's right hand man, yeah? You don't seem too bad. If I had more time, I'd do this myself. But I've got business with your boss. Kill him. Okay, okay, Lao. He might hold out. Useless. Jesus, dude. The guy's a monster. God damn you. The fuck's this door shaking so much? Man, it's just bugged. <laughs> And there's Cal. So how is he gonna get himself out of this, man? My, my. Haven't you heard of knocking? <laughs> Sorry, but I'm in a bit of a rush. Got places to be, things to do. So, white orchid dragon, this is how you do things? That's some lineup you got. Did you see it coming? More or less. We're not foolish enough to challenge blood-drunk war addicts like you head-on. Still, you didn't run away and hide. How about it? Think you got what it takes to subdue an ogre? I'll pass. You'd be an overwhelming foe for Yin, let alone for me. I merely waited for you to come to me, so that I could confirm one little thing. Oh yeah? And what's that? Isn't it obvious? Just who is your current client, I wonder? Who is the highest bidder this time? That is the question. Is it still Erebonia, or has maybe Ouroboros paid them this time? <laughs> I like you. I knew you had some spunk in there somewhere. <laughs> Alright, cow's good. He's out. <laughs> Got away. It was Zack, Pippi left. <laughs> Commander Sigmund! What about his right hand? Forgive us, he's wounded, but... Escaped too, eh? Well, whatever. Let him go underground and sharpen their fangs. Be more interested in this way. Yeah, he just fucking... He said, later, bitch! Fucking got out there, man. Let's finish up here. Light it up and then move out, move on to the IBC building. Ja! IBC, eh? The Mishi Mobile is in action.
forgot how the 100 this game goes. God, yeah, things just... We hit the pedal. We ain't stopping. N no. How terrible. <sighs> Shh. We have to hurry and assess the situation. It's Sergey. You guys hear me all right? Chief, are you all right? Yeah, more or less. This is the big turning point? Yeah, I can tell. This is like the, uh, basically one, almost the climax, right? <clears throat> well, not really the climax. It's just the, like, when everything's going to go ham now, right? Went from moderate danger to crossbell being under siege. Yeah. Yep. Yeah, I want to know who's actually dead, because I'm very concerned. Like, I knew all these people, man. I've been talking to them for two games now. <sighs> Alright, yeah, more or less. Headquarters got hit pretty bad, so we've taken up post at the SSS building. I'm in charge of re-establishing contact. Headquarters was attacked? We'll head there right away. Uh... Kia safe right- he didn't say anything... What about Kia? What about her daughter? We'll head there right away. No need. Sonia's men are already headed over there. Need you to go to the Harbor District. What? Why the Harbor District? Just got word that the Jaegers hit Heiwei's office building. After that, they marched right into the IBC. The main enemy forces attacking Orcus Tower. Sounds like Arios and Dudley are holding their own, but they'll probably need backup from the CGF. The Bracers also have their hands full. They're dealing with the Constellation's military monsters in the city. God damn. So that leaves you guys. <clears throat> so that leaves you guys. You're the only ones who can lend a hand in the Harbor District. But, but what about the SSS building? Is everything fine there, Chief? We're sheltering passerbys that had nowhere else to go. Sight's here so these, those military monsters don't want a piece of us. Ah, oh, thank God. Kia's fine. Kia's here too, safe and sound. Don't worry. Thank goodness. You misspelled rims? What the fuck are you saying? It sounds like they're holding up okay. Understood. We'll head straight for the Harbor District. Oh, dude, the piano though, when, when it hits this part of the song... <clears throat> Thanks, be careful. It's so good. They're attacking the IBC. Are they after Mira? Second best song? Yeah, I mean this song is a banger. It might be my favorite. I'm not sure. Regardless, we need to get over there right away. Honestly, I'm still worried about the situation at headquarters if it was attacked. Me too, but we can't afford to take any detours. There could be people at the IBC building that need our help. You're right. I'm afraid that's where Bell is. I, you know, I still have big questions about Bell because she had that little comment with Kia, you know, on the boat after our fan service. Ignore your sister that took a fucking grenade. She probably doesn't know, man. <clears throat> Rip Fran, she better be okay. I swear to God. I'm afraid that's where Bell is. <clears throat> Yona and Chief Roberts are likely in the Foundation's office, too. Yeah, we should park her as soon as we get to the Harbor District. If we approach the building like this, we're liable to get smacked by an anti-tank tank gun, a Panzer Faust. We have to worry about that, too? Roger, I'll step on it, I'll step on it up to the Harbor District and then no further. Shortly after, the SSS parted ways with the CGF armored cars in the administrative district. They then headed for the harbor district via East Street, while avoiding the battles that had broken out in the city. And poor Crossbow. Heiwei just demolished. Yeah, Saibo. Fucking red constellations, man. Yeah, they need to be ended at this point. It's fucked up. 
AOA building really was hit. Yeah, but I can't imagine that Cow and his men were killed. They likely escaped. We got time to worry about them. Let's book it to the IBC. For the time being, Randy will be a mandatory attack member. At least like which character you like to send to the back line. See ya, Noel. I guess <laughs> Noelle is already support? They didn't even give an option for her. <laughs> Why? Why didn't they give us Noelle as an option? <laughs> oh, it's from the party I was using. Okay, okay, okay. <laughs> I get it. I understand now, I understand. Uh, I don't want to stop, <laughs> bro. There's a time fight him. I mean, I assume there's never gonna be a good point to stop. Yeah, make sure Lloyd's a dodge tank. We do have him set up to be a dodge tank. He's got his two evergreens. What's it? He's at like 95% or something. Or wait, 105% dodge. Ready for your night? Nice break tomorrow. Yeah. I mean, I honestly, I obviously can't trust Anix here. <laughs> but I need to stop soon. Because I do have Thanksgiving stuff going on tomorrow. IBC is the stopping point. Do we have anyone who's trustworthy besides Anixie? Because we know when he said this before, it's been three hours later. So I, I can't, I absolutely cannot trust him. Let's save though, just to, you know. Go to news, check Hayway, go to IBC. You can search because you can't remember. <clears throat> Honestly, you know the fight's right at the IBC building. You can completely trust him. It's not just that I want more trails. <laughs> I know you want more trails. I want more trails, too. All right, we can check these places out, but... <laughs> I want to keep playing, but if I do, it'll, I'll never stop. I did save. You know, I could at least... Sorry, the sound's going to cut out for one second. I apologize. Okay, I see on... Is Zach skipping the weekend this time? I don't know, we might have to stream on the weekend. Trails to sleeping through half Thanksgiving after an all-nighter? No, no, no. <laughs> we'll do the IBC thing, because I see the section here. It can't be more than an hour, right? So let's keep going. All right, and Nage can confirm it as well. Perfect. All right, we're 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 going. We're not fucking leaving. All right, there's a crisis happening outside. This is the last place I would expect to be quiet right now. Do you think Grace and the others evacuated to somewhere safer? <clears throat> oh yeah, this is the boss fight that's like hard as fuck, right? You don't get to take the wheel, Anixi. I fail until I figure it out. All right, you can tell me the positions. That's it. That's fine. You can tell me the positions. That's that's all I'm going for. Oh, I'm sure there's a ton of cutscenes. Do you think Grace and others are back to somewhere safer? No, I can sense several people still within the building. So can I. It ain't a good feeling. Aren't you the... Is she under the desk? Oh, no, she's in the room. Okay. Aww. I recognize you. You're the receptionist here. I see, Dark Fantasy Realms. I see. Lloyd front, Randy... Randy bottom? Mid. Girls far left and right. Sounds like your entire playthrough. <laughs> Shh, keep your voices down. 
I love this part of the song. What, what's going on here? How's it going so far? Oh man, Crimson. Stuff has gotten crazy. Crossbell is on fire. Yeah, a few things are smoking. <laughs> things are bad. There are armed men inside the building. No. I was afraid of that. One of the units broke in here. We're still not sure of the situation in the city, but yes, I believe so. Everyone else in the building was immediately taken hostage at gunpoint. I was away from my post at the time and managed to hide. An unlucky break. Well, where is everyone else right now? I believe there's still two attackers on the top floor. If the city really is in chaos right now, what good would calling for help do? Well, what should we do? We can handle this. We'll save Grace and the others. You will? Thank you so much. Fran's dead, Saibo. Fran's dead. Now that we know the situation, we should make sure we're fully prepared before heading upstairs. I was expecting one of the police officers to, like, jump on the grenade, you know? But, not. Nah, they just all died. <clears throat> Alright, now we know the situation, we should make sure we're fully prepared for heading upstairs. Keep in mind that our opponents are part of the strongest Jaeger course. We cannot be too hasty. If I can help you in any way, please let me know. I have first aid supplies with me, so I can treat you. We'd appreciate that. Alright, once we're ready, let's storm the second floor. Um... Is this a hard fight? They have, like, the whopping three seconds to react. Most people are gonna shut down in that. Yeah, I agree. Cat? No. No. Grace and the others are being held captive upstairs by the Jaegers. Are we good to go, Lloyd? Charge in. Yeah, everyone brace yourselves. Yes, sir. <laughs> no, Saito, no. Just, no, he's being annoying. Have you all lost your minds? What do you hope to gain by attacking the city? That's what I'm trying to figure out. We have our reasons, and they aren't any of your business. Keep your mouth shut, and you'll survive. If you don't, if you don't, then no promises. We'll s silence you ourselves. No, no, please. Not the noodle man. <laughs> I only came here to make a delivery. Why'd I have to get caught up in this? Bring it on. Don't think for a second you can shake this crossbow with a measly thread or two. If you got the stones, then go ahead and try. What are you doing? Dude, Grace got some balls. <laughs> what are you doing, Grace? Why are you provoking them? I mean, they must have got a shit ton of money, Saibo. Like, but who could pay them that much, right? D don't lose your cool. Stay behind me. And you two, if you lay a finger on her, it'll be the last thing you do. <laughs> Look at Ryan stepping up, dude. Play Trails the Fight. Oh, we're playing. We're playing. R Ryan's? Listen to the mouth on this one. You think I'm gonna fall for that? Just shut the hell up until the operation's finished. What is your goal? Operation? What are you planning? Freeze! Intruders! Uh, Lloyd? Captain Randolph? Commencing suppression! Take him down! <laughs> Let's go! Do we need to scan these boys? Um, I guess not. Uh. Tio, blast him! <laughs> Alright, so we don't need to scan them, thankfully. I love you, you're a scanner. Dude, we scan every single thing. No matter the cost. Hey, this guy's kind of strong. And spark dying. Light a bitch. Another one. 
Oh, <laughs> he's dead as fuck. Later. Yo, Ellie f fucking claps things, man. <laughs> Terrible. Ugh. We have no choice but to withdraw. Wait. You're 100% or two? Ah, nice. Yeah, I hate I hate following guides, but for trails specifically, I do it. And luckily they like keep it so you don't get spoiled, which is nice, but <clears throat> Trails has too much content like that you could miss if you don't like go for everything. Neo Seeker? Oh. Wait. Yeah, Trails requires a guide. Yeah. Unfortunately, they seriously jumped? I would have liked the opportunity to ask them a few questions. Lloyd, you guys all right? We're fine. What about you, Grace? Are you all, all of you unharmed? God, Grace, you're amazing. Yeah, thankfully no one was injured. Thanks to you guys, anyway. You just, you got here just in time. Seriously, Grace, you could have gotten yourself killed back there. I was fearing the worst once you started provoking them. Oh, excuse me, sorry. Come on, I was only giving them a taste of their own medicine. <clears throat> As a journalist, I can't fold in the face of threats and violence. Grace, shut up. I love Grace! You shut up, mage! <laughs> Enough about me. What about Rhines? Never seen that side of your partner. Didn't know you cared about me enough to put your life on the line. <laughs> the reason you ain't dead because of Ryan's, basically. <laughs> I guess I got swept up in the heat of the moment. I wasn't really thinking about what I was saying. Don't be so modest, Chop. You were a regular knight in shining armor there. That aside, we're glad you're all safe. I'm still confused as to why the Jaegers would target the news service. That is a cause for concern. This should not have been a location worth attacking from their perspective, unlike the Hayway building. <clears throat> Are there enough people alive for a talk tour? Not anymore, <laughs> Saibo. Not anymore. Unlucky. Oh yeah, he really wants to talk to the shitter mayor and druggy and ma yeah, we don't we don't visit the cities <laughs> or the not the cities, the towns. Little village. I think I might know. They might have been gunning for the international receiver over there. International receiver? Oh, but why? In other words, that receiver can send orbital waves outside of Crossbow. It's possible they were trying to prevent Heiwei from coming here to request backup from the Republic. Ah, that makes sense. Th yes, Wazi, I agree. That would make sense. I've gotta agree. When they first got to the Harbor District, they came straight here before hitting Hayway. Honestly, it all happened pretty darn fast. We were totally caught off, caught with our pants down. Ho -ho. Regardless of why they came here, we need to get, we need to hurry. Hayway's been torched, and they're targeting the IBC building next. You're right. If they're willing to go this far, I doubt they're after Mira. We should all stay inside until we get the situation under control. Y yeah, we will. You guys are going out there. Watch each other's backs, you hear? If you manage to clean this mess up, I promise the front page is yours. Well, it fucking better be, Grace. <laughs> the thought is encouraging enough, Grace. Alright, team. To the IBC building. <laughs> God damn it, Saivo, no. Not that I'm... Well, I mean, not necessarily no, but... You know, God damn it, Saivo. All right. Hayway's building is completely destroyed. No doubt that it was the handiwork of my uncle and the others. I can still smell gunpowder burning in the air. I know the smell of red constellations mix anywhere. Yeah, I can tell it's the same as what was used at the entrance to the deserted mine outside of Mainz. There's no sign of cow or his men. I'm confident they managed to escape. Yes, but looking at the damage around the building, there must have been a struggle. I can't imagine they left unscathed. I hope Yen Rishia is okay too. Tonight was supposed to be the opening of their encore performance. Rip. 
I'm worried too, but we don't have time to head back to the entertainment district. Come on, we have to get to the IBC. All right. Fuck. I hate to. Do I hate this, but I gotta use the bathroom. I don't think I can make it through the fight with a straight thought process unless I pee. So I'll be right back. One second, guys. Okay, we're back. I'm sorry about that. Oh, <laughs> the game got me too excited. I had to pee, and we saved, right? Let's do it again anyway. Oh, I didn't set. Oh shit, I didn't change my tactics. Oh shit. Well, hopefully we get a chance to. Are you okay? Uh, what? Game? That was fucking weird. Okay. Wh <clears throat> What's going on at the building? Well, we're fine. These guys with guns came out of nowhere and told us to get out. And it's the traitor. They destroyed the special alloy gate in the front like it was nothing. That must be the Red Constellation. We were told that they were a top-level security threat, but they're even more terrifying than I'd imagine. G guys, you're here! <laughs> Chief, right? Yeah, of course. God damn it. Yona, Chief. Thank goodness. Uh, uh, we're alive somehow. Th those men had us at gunpoint before we even knew they were here. there. <laughs> same, Saiba. <laughs> same. <laughs> what the hell? Intel said they were dangerous, not completely out of their minds. Is that scary old dude with the red hair their boss or something? Oh shit, is that who we're gonna have to fight here? Oh no. That has to be... The Red Ogre. That guy's a freak of nature. <coughs> well, what about Belle? Is she still in the building? Miss Croy is currently in Michelin thanks to Idios. Oh, thank, not thanks too, but thank Ideos. Huh, quite convenient, Bell. She's in no no danger, Miss McDowell. Phew, thank, thank you, goddess. They seem to have spared civilians. That doesn't make what they are doing okay. What are they trying to achieve? Same question. I'm not sure, but it can be good. We need to get up there, now. Right. The way to East Street is clear. <clears throat> Lead everyone there and take shelter at the guild. Uh, right. Everyone follow us. We'll take you to safety. Okay. So we can. Alright, so tactics. The recommendation is what? Like this? Like this? Seems, seems these, right? Tio and LA are far back. You want Randy back more? What the fuck's- what's he gonna do? I don't know about that, dude. Alright, we'll try that. <clears throat> oh wait, you don't want him in- I guess I don't know what I'm- what I'm up against here. I don't know. Alright, what do you got to say, Yona? I sometimes come across info about these guys on the Orbal Net. Yeah, I get that. Okay, I get it. We're just having Lloyd Dodge tank his life away.
from Nightmare Defenses. <clears throat> Never heard they were this crazy, though. If you're seriously going up there to fight them, better be careful. We will be, Yona. You be careful, too, and take shelter. You have to skip... Yeah, yeah, I got you. It's a... Is it a hard fight, or is it just the fact that it's timed the hard thing? Alright, that's just healing. Yes, very hard. Timed and hard. Oh, great. Alright, just to forewarn you, I'm probably going to fail, then. Because, I mean, the strategy that I have in mind right now is Spark Dine with Ellie, um, the Crimson Ray with Tio, Dodge Tank Lloyd, And I don't know what the fuck Randy's gonna do. You're not helping me? Alright, that's fine. I mean, I'm sure I'm gonna fail then. If there's a one-shot... I don't know what I'm gonna do. I mean, zero field Tio, obviously. There's probably an attack I have to zero field. Alright, let's just go. Not gonna use Noelle or Wazi? Hell no. We the OG SSS. You're gonna get hit for 25k? Oh, fuck. <laughs> Fucking awesome, man. I always stick with OG. I'm gonna be torn if they, like, I don't know, but I feel like I'm gonna get Rishia as a permanent member, and I will be torn because I love Rishia. Of course, maybe we won't even get her as a member. No spoilers, please, though. Oh, fuck, yep, this song. <laughs> you got here just in time. Yeah, we're fighting this asshole. Okay. Uncle, you bastard. Sigmund Orlando? What is it you're trying to accomplish? Destroying Crossbill City? Involving innocent civilians? Are you insane? Was this on orders from the Imperial government too? Sorry, little lady. Didn't I tell you before? It's core policy to not comment about our clients. But enough about that. So, Randolph, heard you dug up your old blade rifle. Berserker, yeah? I finally had the damn thing fixed up, too. Then your lunatic of a daughter went and broke it again. Not that it matters. Berserker or not, I'm stopping you right here, right now. I ain't saying that as the Red Reaper or the son of the War God. Your ass is going down at the hands of the special support section's Randy Orlando. Let's go, Randy! Ugh, Randy. Welcome back, Randy. <laughs> so you've chosen to stand up to me. Then show me what you got. Show me you got what it takes to back those words up. Face the Red Ogre! Fuck. Make Sigmund Orlando retreat if you can. Alright, times. Is that a battle aura? He really is more ogre than human. Let's see what you got. You're welcome to make me back down. I'm gonna try my best, but I expect failure the first time. And that's okay. But business is business. I got a job to do. I'm gonna have to re to enforce the time limit on this one. Um, is there a clear indicator whether I did it in time versus not in time? Hey, what? I don't know what the hell he's talking about, but it doesn't matter. If you want to survive this, then you better go all out. HP to zero? Oh, okay. I see, I see. <laughs> That's fair. So if it ends before his HP goes to zero, then I have to reset. So we just start pumping from the beginning? <laughs> oh, we do nothing. You said keep Randy away, but what? I don't know what I'm supposed to do then. Oh, wait, that's what we do. Okay. 
Does he have... He doesn't have anything, Chrono Drive! Oh no. Okay, well, there's that. Okay, so we pop... I, I understand now. Oh, I can just hit retry, yeah? If he war cries, you will die. Okay, so... We need to pop zero field. We just keep zero field up, right? I think that's the play. We'll just use it right here. And then, we'll... I hope I have stuff to raise her CP with Rand... Oh, we need to skip that. So that's the that's the preemptive thing, right? Uh I don't know what else you can do, idiot. Oh shit, that's not good. Yeah, she's gonna die now. Because I don't have a way to uh Oh, fuck. We're dead. Well, Ellie's dead. Oh, it's a single target. Um. Alright. Let's go! <laughs> that wasn't bad, okay. That wasn't bad at all. You just have to avoid the one shot, right? And that, and then you're good. I was worried about timer. We had plenty of time to... Oh, man. You were talking it up, Anixie. <laughs> Can't wait to play that on Nightmare. I'm sure that is an actual Nightmare. He says, yeah, it's something. All the XP. All of it. All the Sky games on Nightmare? Oh, I'm sure that's rough, too. Anixie's played all this shit on Nightmare. He's crazy. This is a surprise. You really are your daddy's boy. His blood runs strong whether you like it or not. Ah, oh, please. My old man has nothing to do with this. Looks like you got caught off guard because you're taking it easy on us. It don't matter though. A win's a win. Time to retreat, you bastard. <laughs> Fine. Just as soon as I wrap up the last little part of my job. What? <clears throat> Is he gonna like blow up the IBC building or something? That'd be fucking crazy. Alright. Showtime. Oh, yep. Oh, shit, dude. But why? All the extra seven? No, no. Yeah, that place is done. Ah, poor Tio. The hell? Uncle! <laughs> it's always the small laugh and the big laugh. I'm sorry, I can't do it. <laughs> he 
He's out. What a fucking scene this is, man. Everything, like, Crossbell stood for, right? Right there. The money, the power. And Wald joined these fuckers, eh? Wald? Huh. Her too? Damn it, how did they get their hands on something like that? Ah! Damn. Oh, Crossbell's fucked. Oh, Campanella and I can't remember her name already. But the, the really OP lady. Oh, with no mask on me? <laughs> what a splendid sight. Even the symbol of Crossbell's economy has gone up in flames. A red constellation, huh? I'll give them credit. They're more impressive than our enhanced Jaegers. Our Inrod, yeah. Ooh, I like her, though. First time seeing a glimpse of her face. <laughs> I suppose you object to this kind of stunt. That is correct. However, war is heartless by nature. One must navigate the battlefield as they see fit. Remember what happened to the last villain woman you liked? <laughs> I can't help it, Saivo. She seems so cool. <laughs> Fair enough. You just reminded me that Ilya is actually dead, and I'm very sad. <sighs> ah, Professor, what do you need? Oh, the first unit is finally complete. I understand. I just have to come back and assist you, right? And so, I shall leave the stage for now. What did you say is complete? The first unit. Interesting. Can I leave the operations in your hands until the promised day? <laughs> Silo. Yes. That is fine. Gosh, she looks so cool. Why has she got to be evil? I will observe the fate held in store for this land with my own two eyes. Damn, this song is really good too. Oh, I love this game. I love it. Good boy, Zite. Good boy. Back to the somber song. What, what the heck is going on outside? I wonder if my husband is all right. Calm down, everyone. I just received word that the armed group has started to withdraw. Starting to see how Azure so well regarded? Yes. This has definitely revealed why it's so good to me. I was kind of curious, I mean I knew it was going to get good, but I was wondering when it was going to happen, because the first part of the game, it was kind of like, it was good, but where does this greatest of all time come in? Now I see it. Now I fucking see it. <clears throat> Once your safety is confirmed, you can all return home. Uh, are you sure? Oh, oh, Ideos, thank you for your protection. Aw, Kia. Is it okay now, Chief? Yeah, for the time being at least. I hope the gang's alright. I'm sure they are. I know them, so they'll be fine. Hmm, yeah, you're right. No matter what anyone says, they've grown a lot. Maybe even more than my old squad. Damn. This is a special support... That you, Dudley? 
How's the situation over there? What did you say? A Jaeger airship? Where are you going, Kia? To the roof? She's glowy again, uh-oh. With a significantly smaller area than Liberal and custom NBCs you interact with far more, it makes it hit a lot harder when this happens. Yes, exactly. Exactly. <clears throat> Alright. Well, I was right. There's no other way. This is for the best. No. Mm. Wait, she has a phone? Hello? Yes, uh-huh. The fuck she get one of these it's okay I've made up my mind don't you leave us too Kia man what a fucking Sequence of events, man. So crazy. So crazy. Um, do we want to read through all this? Yeah, we can, we can read through this real quick. Just as night fell, we here at the CNS heard something surprising. The sound of gunfire. Crossbow City was being raided by Jaegers. Fires r raged and we were held captive. Now that dawn has come, we will do our best to retell all that transpired and shed light on the many wounds our great city has suffered. <clears throat> the large bell that's in the center square symbol cross itself was stolen. That feels significant. Okay, that, that feels very significant. The raiders stormed the theater. All right, so tragedy strikes our conceal. The Raiders stormed the theater during the group's first showing of its encore performance and let loose haphazard machine gunfire. Many were injured. Amidst the turmoil, the Grand Chandelier was cut down and pinned Ilio Platier beneath it. Her wounds were critical, and she was rushed to St. Ursula Medical College to receive emergency surgery. Until new information becomes available, available her current status is unknown. I mean, that's not dead? Right? The Arkansas Theater is now off limits to the public. Rampage of the Downtown Demon. A giant monster appeared downtown and destroyed several buildings. Local cross bellens sustained both minor and major injuries. The demon, believed to be associated with the raiders, roared so loudly that it could be heard from Central Square and Station Street. <clears throat> Explosion at the CPD headquarters. The militia also attacked the CPD's headquarters, destroying the city's, destroying the security shutters and blowing up the lobby. Experts believe this to have been a preemptive attack meant to slow the police's response to the raid. Fuck. In the aftermath, nearly the entire city was overtaken by the raiders. They engaged in firefights, committed arson, and demolished a trading company's office in the Harbor District. IBC building destroyed in an explosion. IBC headquarters, one of the most cutting-edge buildings in the city, has been gutted by a series of explosions. Due to the IBC's importance to both the people of Crossbell and the international economy at large, many are distressed over its destruction. <clears throat> Attackers repelled from Orcus Tower. It is likely that the raiders' primary target was the heart of Crossbell's government, Orcus Tower. An estimated half of their forces attempted to seize it, and the fighting is said to have been more intense than it elsewhere. In the city, luckily, oh, elsewhere in the city, luckily, an A-rank bracer, Arios McLean, happened to be present and cooperated with the police to drive back the raiders after hours of non-stop combat. The tower's plaza remains inaccessible, but officials state all administrative functions will be restored in the next few days. I mean, I, they would have... Sigmund would have attacked there, right? If that's what their goal was. That's what I would think. It had to have been the IBC for some reason. Which Belle was mysteriously not there. And after that moment on the boat... I don't know, man. I don't know about her. A message to all cross Bellans and our neighbors. As the sun appeared over the horizon, 
The raiders vanished to goddess knows where. Though the perpetrators are gone, the wounds they left behind remain. Crossbell has suffered because of a militant force who perpetrated acts of wanton, <clears throat> wanton violence with no clear motive or objective. We here at the Crossbell News Service cannot help but feel intense anger at this irrational chain of events. I would like to take a moment to pray for the brave CGF and CPD members who lost their lives in the conflict. My deepest sympathies go out to the injured and those who otherwise experienced loss. Additionally, I would like to thank everyone involved in bringing this conflict to a close. Even if it was beyond their abilities, there were those who, without hesitation, helped to evacuate other citizens even as their homes burned around them. These brave heroes deserve the highest praise, as praise someone like me can bestow upon them. Crossbow has been battered and bruised. However, I believe that we can recover. To all Crossbellans and our closest neighbors, I beg of you all, please pray for peace to return to this land of ours. Fuck. One week after the Red Constellation raided Crossbell City. Security levels in surrounding nations had risen due to the attack on the IBC building. In response, Maribel, in her role of a as acting CEO, had all customer data backed up on terminals at Orcus Tower. Her crisis management successfully assuaged the concerns of foreign leaders and slowly international tensions began to subside. However, the scars left on Crossbell citizens remained. News that Ilya Platier had been gravely injured in the attack came as a great shock both in and out of the state. The destruction of CPD's headquarters and the Red Constellation's whereabouts being unknown had gripped the city with an indescribable anxiety. Slowly, rumors began to spread that Erebonia was the one that ordered the Red Constellation's attack on Crossbell. But rumors, I mean, we don't know. The referendum on state independence, which had been postponed due to the raid, was three days from being held. Damn. First building we ever went into, I think, in uh, Crossbow, right? And now it's destroyed. And if you don't count the train station. Anyway, I mean, yeah, that sucks. Whew. What an event, man. No, he's got so much to sweep up now! <laughs> Fucking sweeping kid. As far as you're concerned, Crossbow's the best city ever in a JRPG. I would be inclined to agree with you. Yeah. It's... Yeah. I got no arguments against it. I see. You're returning to the CGF. Noel? Yes. I wanted my transfer here to last the full six months. But... After thinking about it, I came to the decision that I have to go back. No part of it's wasted at all. The entire place is super important. Yeah, that's what's so great about it. Like, I know every building in the city. I know most of the characters, right? <clears throat> I know all of their personalities. I have my favorites, you know, and stuff like that. Yeah. Oh, now you're losing the well. How will you cope? I just want to know if Fran's okay. That's that's all I really want to know. I'm um, I'm inclined to say no after seeing the building and that she was right by the grenade. So. I <clears throat> I see. We understand. CGF sustained the most losses from the incident. 
They're probably dying to have someone young and skilled like yourself anyway. Well, I don't know if I'd call myself skilled. I'm sorry. I know things would be busier here. Now that the restoration effort has reached a steady point. It's okay. You don't need to beat yourself up. Considering Crossbow's situation, the CGF has a large role to fulfill. We will certainly miss you, but we can only respect your decision. Are you going away, Noel? No. Oh. <laughs> I guess I am. I'm sad I won't be able to see you anymore, Kia. Okay. It's alright. I can still come visit. Now bring Fran with me, too. Is she okay? Huh? Oh. Ooh. Noel. Noel. I heard your sister's going to be hospitalized for a while. Yes, her operation was successful and she regained consciousness. There's nothing to be worried about. Alright, that's good. I mean, I, that sucks, but at least she's alive, right? But she hasn't regained any of her physical strength. Right. Oh, man. <laughs> Randy, please don't give me that look. Don't forget that she's a police officer. She was always ready to face danger. If you're blaming yourself, please don't. It's not your fault. <laughs> fine, fine. Anyway, I guess today's the last day Noelle's gonna be working with us. Right. I'll give it everything I have. It's been a pleasure working with you, everyone. Yeah, likewise. I really enjoyed working with you too, Noelle. I'll get all the documentation ready. Did you ever expect to feel this about Fran? I mean, she was so happy and bubbly all the time, man. Like, yeah, no, she wasn't my favorite, but her personality was important to my life in Crossbell. And now she's hospitalized. She, I don't know what to what extent. She has no physical power. So does that mean she's going to be, like, wheelchair? Like, I don't know. Like, it sucks, man. It's also been a while, while since we've all gone out together for dinner, so let's fix that. Seeing as how it's a special occasion, it's on me. Chief Sergei. That's awfully nice of you. How generous. Uh, about going to my favorite club. I'll call in some sharply dressed men and give you a farewell party to remember. Heh <laughs> Wazzy. Oh, what? Not too bad an idea. I'd rather go somewhere ladies are the ones taking it all off, though. God damn it, Randy. Now's not the time, you guys. I don't like either of those ideas. Might I suggest the restaurant at Michelin Wonderland with the Mishi Show? <laughs> Sparkles? Ah. Fucking deal. Is there a restaurant like that? Please think about my poor wallet before you get ahead of yourselves. <laughs> Regardless, we need to take care of our work by nighttime. Grr. Oof. Thanks for your input, Zite. Damn. We made it. Are there any requests anymore? Oh, fuck. Fuck. There's four. Let's take a look at these real quick. Downtown reconstruction support by Abbas. Reconstructing, down reconstructing downtown has been difficult for us. Please come by if you have time. You can learn more at Guillaume Factory. Charity event. Business Owners Association. The Business Owners Association is holding a charity event to raise people's spirits following the recent attack. However, we need help, or we won't be able to put on our main events. We'd like you to... We would love to make this event happen. Please come by if you can. The event will be held in the Civic Center. Long Lost Father. Oh, it's Armand and Ellie. I'm looking for my father, whom I was separated at a very young age. Please, please speak with us at the restaurant? It wasn't that place we were in earlier? 
I mean, the, this song is like a very appropriate song for the situation. Ancient Battlefield Investigation? Deputy Commander Douglas. There have been several reports of strange black monsters in the eastern regions of the state. I am requesting that you investigate and eliminate this potential threat. Come to my top office in Tangram. We can finish the fishing now? Hell yeah, that's good. I can do that. And then a monster extermination on Oxford. Damn. Oh. After what happened, it's no surprise that we have a lot of requests. However, none of them appear to be urgent. Yep, but not even one Abyssinian is required. Guess we can keep doing our rounds while we slowly work through them. Roger. One more thing, everyone. Why don't we visit St. Ursula Hospital when we take a break? Uh-huh. Oh, that would be nice. We've been so overworked this last week that we haven't been able to visit at all. Agreed. Fran's regained consciousness, so we definitely gotta go see her. B but Yeah, not hearing her cheery voice through the terminal is downright depressing. I wonder, is she, like, scarred really bad? That would be sad. Indeed, I would love to hear her voice. Don't be so reserved, Noelle. Fran's been supporting us all this time. Of course we'd want to see her. Thank you so much, everyone. Okay, let's go see Nurse later when we have some downtime. Save and go say hi. It's part of the main quest. Yeah, we're not doing that yet. We're doing all our other quests, and then we'll go to the hospital as the last thing, probably. Probably. But... That is going to be the end for me tonight. <laughs> I've gone a little bit longer than I usually would, so... NXT says, a warning. What is your warning, sir? The downtown reconstruction made you do the city raid twice. I was gonna say, <laughs> that looked fine. I fucked up the optional DP twice on it. Why would you redo the city raid? Didn't Did you not save before, sir? Uh, you, well, that's your own dumbass problem. <laughs> no offense. <laughs> uh, Alright, guys, that's it for me for the, the night. This game, absolutely insane now. I see why people love it. My emotions were everywhere during these events. Just do... Uh, yeah, well, I mean, just remind me later, man. It's fine. It only, it only goes up from here, really. See, like, my... If I was playing through this without anybody else here, I would be like, that was probably the peak of this game, right? That... How do you beat that moment? You're still on the vertical incline? She. Well, that's good to know. Alright. So, next time we'll knock out the support request and keep knocking out the rest of the game. I fucking love this game now. I mean, I loved it before, but this is amazing now. So, I'm very excited. I'm not gonna be able to sleep. I don't know. I wish... I didn't have to take tomorrow... I don't have to take tomorrow off, but I'm afraid that... People who want to watch will miss it because of the holiday, so I don't want to stream tomorrow. So that means I will be back Friday with more Azure. So we will be back Friday. Yeah, I mean, I'm bas I beat Pokemon already, so I don't know what I'll do. But, as I said, we'll be back, um... Friday evening around 7 p.m. Eastern for more Azure and see where this crazy ass game is gonna go. Why not Pokemon Friday? Because I want to play Azure, Saivo! We're not. I, I, this is the problem now that I'm gonna have. <clears throat> it's not that exciting. Fuck off. Fuck off. Alright guys, I appreciate everybody watching, and 
I appreciate the raid from Neo. That was awesome, especially during this high pass moment. It just, you know, it's crazy. But everybody, enjoy the rest of your evening, morning, afternoon, whatever time zone you're in. I appreciate y'all being here, and if you enjoyed it, follow and check me out on Friday. We will be continuing more. So thank you very much, guys. I appreciate it.